what a blessed day. Ooh, it would be even more blessed if I plugged in the right cords. Ugh. Oh, come on, baby. Let's see if Windows can do the impossible and clone a display while a game's running. Cha-cha-cha! Yes! Uh, it is, it's Big Chris Day. It's, it's Wolf Chris Day. It's Big Lady Day. Resident Evil 8 is out. Eric, thank you for the resub. Can't stay too long, but we'll lurk. Hope you, hope you enjoy Resident Evil 8. I mean, it sounds like I'm going to enjoy at least part of it. <laughs> and that's, that's enough for me when it comes to Resident Evil. Oh. I'm really, really excited. And I'm going to, I'm going to play with the appropriate brightness settings. That's right. You can't see the picture on the left at all. I mean, I that's I can always see it though. Okay, well we'll just leave that in the middle. This feels weird. Uh, oh, that's right. You have to agree to like eight pol eight privacy policy things. <laughs> I just want to see Big Chris. Oh, he's so big. He's so wide. Mayonazio, hello. Thank you for the prime. <clears throat> you know what? Yeah. Okay. Games more and more are becoming uh, so artful. They don't they don't deliver you to a, a root menu before hitting you with all the lore and narrative. And My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years Hunky since Wolves. Thank the you for the house. sub. I was looking for my wife. Too many nits on my screen. I got an email. What'd you from say about my screen? I'm gonna take this outside, she buddy. Told me to come oh, get her. Pay attention to this. And of course, <laughs> I got that's another how I one. In the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. <laughs> Doctor, thank you for the cheer. That's very spooky. I feel. I, I feel. Mia being held captive. I'm excited about basement. about spookiness. I hope it's very spooky. At least at the beginning. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Is there any game? Later on, I found out that she was infected. That's spooky the whole way. Mold. Mm, there are. Soma comes to I mind. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote. A vaccine. Anything. I think you can't have, like, combat mechanics. The people who live there. And for a game infected. to stay spooky the whole time. What Alien was Isolation. Wasn't human. It's called life. <laughs> the source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Yeah, remember that? Remember that? Her a little girl? Evelyn. Evelyn? Everybody remembers that, right? I fought the fucked up family. And was able to treat me as symptoms. It's not itself. just the family, it's Evelyn. We have to remember that. No full screen. I haven't gotten to a menu yet. It's just been hitting me with privacy policies. And soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. And gave, gave wanted to give me a little plot primer. So, <laughs> yeah, it's, just, it's stuck that way for now. Because I haven't been able to change it. Ray tasting is off by default. Is enough? Not for long. Not for long. I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. I paid $18,000 so I can slap that RTX on button. It's all over now. And I'm going to. My body is doing just fine with one liver. That's a pretty sick title screen. Pretty sick title screen. Here we go. Now we're doing it. Now we're flying. Now we're zooming. Display. Here we go. Oh, it changes every time. Let's do that. It's going full screen. Yes, it is. And one more for the borderless. Zing. Yeah, now we're doing it. And somehow it didn't go to desktop. <sighs> okay. Somebody said variable variable frame rate wasn't great, but I usually just set it to, uh, to 120 as well. Um, and then I let G-Sync handle the, the vertical sync. That's weird. Why does it interlace to just have, like, different shadowing? That's how bizarre. How hard can it go? I don't know what that number means, but I'm sure I want it on. I'm sure I do. Damn, I have no idea what variable rate shading is. It looks like some kind of, uh... Some kind of new, wacky, uh, ambient occlusion tech? Hmm. My laptop would be melting right now. How come you only stream in 900, not 8, 1080? Um, so, 
it's an exchange between the load on the CPU to encode the video and the quality of the frame and the bitrate of the video. So um, Twitch's, Twitch's video stream bitrate is very low. Six megabit, that's low. Um, if things are moving fast, uh, the bitrate is so low that it won't look that good even if it is 1080p. Um, so I, what I kind of did is I did some tests about what my processor can do versus the image quality that I get. And doing 900p but a higher uh, quality video encode kind of resulted in a better overall image. A, a smoother image, yeah. And then the bitrate is so low that the quality trade-off was extremely minimal. It was one of those things where if, if I was standing stock still and looking at something that was also still, then the image quality was better, 1080p, clearly. But that's rare in video games. I mean, a menu like this would look better in 1080. But once the game starts, there's going to be a lot more motion. Anyway. Ray tracing activated. Okay. You know what? I wanted to go to the top of the menu. I understand. It's a different menu now. It's being ray traced. So walking through it again is like a... It's like a... Oh, okay. It had to load new... Uh, had to load new settings. New settings. Not new settings. That's later. You can you can do ray tracing plus ambient occlusion? That seems... That seems... Uh, Excessive. Isn't the viewing window on Twitch with chat open like 900p-ish anyway? I've heard that. Um, I think it's not... Like, chat isn't that wide. Chat is not um, 380 pixels wide. I, I don't think. <laughs> you got me questioning now. Oh man, subsurface scattering is so good. For real, like, that sounds like a weird thing to be a fanboy of, but... Do I like film grain? Didn't you already ask me that? I like it in some games, but I think as soon as I see it, then I'm like... Or as soon as I... If I see the game, like, a certain way to start, that's just kind of how I think about it. I don't know that... Eh, should this game be as dirty and gritty? I don't know about that. Film noise is awful, turn it off. I mean, most people, I think, dislike grain and noise. Oh, it's genuinely awful in this. I thought it was weird that it, it topped out the uh, graphical effects button. Also, I didn't I didn't even see any grain. It just seemed to make everything darker. So I don't know what that's all about. Huncules, thanks for gifting a sub. You gonna play with that found footage filter? Is that what the film grain is? Um, I mean, at some point, maybe. Oops. I did not mean to do that. How do I get out of this menu? Thank you. Well, the rest I can probably leave. I can probably throw to the wind. Leave for the on-screen bindings. All right, it's game time. I'm going to assume this is like the other Resident Evils. And I'm going to do hardcore first because I want to unlock the actual difficulty. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. Boo! <laughs> So I'm the Wolfman. Them with a dark, cold silence. Wolfman. She's empty. Can't wait for that Wolfman. Yet man. determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. I did wonder if if this her. art style and this storytelling style was going to continue throughout the game. Became bone dry. They then showed this Lord um, appeared. before. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. I'm not so going anywhere. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Ooh, more for the scant train, thank you. Graveyard, menacing thank you for fueling storm clouds loomed. That and spooky the train. Trained, bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared. And with a click of his fingers, crafted you already a mist me that? into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself. Chaos. Thank you so for the giant cheer. And smiled with joy. You have dumped gasoline all over that ghost train. And ominous she went, making it a flaming gas ghost train. she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened, and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared king. and offered one of his many fins. Yay. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate, 
and smiled with joy. Uh, stares to oblivion. Thanks for the spooky Continue. sub. Entered the forest dark heart. The Death Star. Then Game rip off. Appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. This is really cool. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Look at that chubby there. baby. She's asleep. I want to poke the chub. What is with the creepy story? She's uh, crab foam. Thanks for gifting five subs and Hermes. The store said it was traditional. Thank you for the sub. We're a big woman. We're go we go into big woman. Besides, I can feel the gravitational pull of Big Woman in this universe already. It. Thank God. We moved her so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? Squishy There's nothing child. wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not. Never mind. Oh, shit, I'm getting I'm gaslit. Sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. This is some midsummer shit happening right, right now. Cautiously take your daughter to bed. The, mm, there's some weirdness in the, the like light blending. We'll finish dinner. Maybe that's the uh, RTX stuff you were talking about? Well, maybe not. Maybe that's just a one-time thing. It's okay, Rose. Squeeze. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. I can't blame her. You're seeing screen tearing. Really? Did you say Oh, something? wow. Yeah, you're Nothing. not kidding. I'll put her down. That... Wow, you're not... That's crazy. Yeah, that's really bad. Wait. Is it... Doesn't seem like it's happening now? Am I crazy? <laughs> yeah, that fixed it. What the heck? What the heck is that all about? Okay, whatever. Ari engine. Yeah, it looks... It looks fine now. Looks fine to me. Chunky baby... Hey, I'll tap fix it. <laughs> Man, whatever. I don't know. Uh, the more I think I understand, like, Windows displays and refresh rates and, and game capture and video encoding, the, le the less it's con it's consistent. I remember, uh, I remember, um, Once you're a big give the baby some wine. drink together, all right? I remember, uh, like, I think I was playing Doom Eternal, kind of thinking wistfully about quantum physics and how we can, you know, we form theories about the truth and then we try to find information to disprove it over the years every day everything i've ever thought about video is proven wrong oh candles thank you for the raid bongo the man thanks for the prime i want some of this bread this game could have been the first game ever to let you aim down sights of a newborn child but Unfortunately, Capcom is you being hungry? cowardly once again. No? Maybe later then. Let's feed this baby. You lock on to the nearest baby food. Don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. Jesus. Mia's prickly tonight. She's wearing her, uh... <laughs> she's wearing her no-sex sweater. I think that's what you'd call that. It's Buffy reruns on DVD again. Maybe that's a little too dated at this Mia point. Mia makes everything by hand, so this Office stuff keeps piling up. Just give the baby a tour of the house. No big deal. Hurry up and put Rose to sleep, will you? Are they alcoholics? They're parents. Yes. Child. She's going to grow up beautiful. Child. So a big woman's not gonna take my take my daughter. You can't do that. In this the age of Sony? Making me a protective father is the worst thing you could do. Oh <clears throat> there, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yeah, Mia's a little prickly, huh? 
I mean, they got a lot of good mileage out of out of making her scream in your face in your the first game. Your mom this song so much. Capcom. Give them awards. Don't you understand? I shook the baby, but in a good way. I don't know where this baby goes. <coughs> so this is gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Curtain closes on the Dolve gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into Dolve toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded that the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. It's swamp gas as usual. Jack Baker and his family, who were exposed to the gas, perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Swamp fart. Mold outbreak. Weird uh, psychic lady. Did they, What was the vector? Like, how did... How did Angry girl create super mold. That's what I don't remember that connection. Is it same old like umbrella created a chemical weapon Almost super soldier there, thing? Can't wait to see a wolf man. Oh, Cammy, I mean, you just downloaded RE8. You better get ready for child. <laughs> Some mind control shit. Yeah, yeah, it was like psychic stuff, which. I uh, well, I guess this is this is the series that had Wesker like blinking around with supernatural energy. So, umbrella creator, yeah, there it is. Don't you worry. Evelyn was a B.O.W. Right gotcha. That works. Daddy won't Fine. let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Evie was basically the E virus, wanted to create a family and infect people with mold. Nice, a real biohazard, if you will. So many doilies, man. Is Mia a doily lady? A cross-stitch doily lady? Is that who I'm dealing with? Is that who... Is that the love of my life? Is that who I got my hand stapled back on for? Damn, man. Wait, does he still have staple hand? February 6th, 2021. Mia and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly, but I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. Well, thank you guys for the well, the wonderful hype train. It's, uh, it's, it's a good way to start. Spooky Wolfman Chris Knight. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Too true. Additional fungal pathogen tests. Rose is fine. Also, I gotta say... No offense out there to our short brethren, but I'm feeling a little, a little manlity in this house. Like, the top of the dresser is it's like hitting me in the shoulder blades. <laughs> Maybe that's why she's so mean. Because, yeah, e Ethan's like four foot seven. <laughs> Somehow we overcame your terrible I shortness. You stay like this forever. To have a beautiful baby daughter. You want it to stay like this? With Mia screaming at you in public? And you not being able to reach the, the tallest shelves in the kitchen? That's where she puts all the snacks that she knows you like. And you go into the kitchen every time. And you're like, oh man. <laughs> Jesus, Mia, that's mean. It's not paranoia if they're really out to get you. Okay, alright. I've, I've mumbled about paranoia to myself in an empty bedroom. <laughs> it's been a productive night. I got snapped at by my girlfriend. And wandered around the house aimlessly with my child. Kendo wrote a book. Yeah, let me. Actually, I didn't. I didn't look much at the bookshelf. 
But Kendo got Kendo died died, right? Yeah, I guess so. Maybe uh maybe he published a book before the events of Resident Evil 2. You ever think about how five foot eight people are actually four foot twenty? Holy shit. I mean I no, I didn't until just now. That's beautiful. I support any loose math to rework number combinations in our, our universe to 420 and 69. Ever since the incident. Mia's having a rough time, alright? She's processing trauma. And when humans do that, sometimes they lash out at the people around them. Let's go have an uncomfortable talk now. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. You see that HD mm, soup? That smells good. What's 4K that? soup. Oh, hands off, Mister. It's chorba de legume. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. Wow. <sighs> really, Mia? Really? Stop worrying. <sighs> it's just. Finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <laughs> Cool. Mia, get down! Well, I took care of that then, huh? She's fucking dead. I don't know about that. She's gonna come back as a monster or something. Mia. Oh, gosh. She got pretty tore up, though. Chris? What the hell? Sorry. No! What? Why? <laughs> like that Halo trailer? It's, what do you think? Is it gonna be like a shapeshifter? Go on, move! Am I like, uh... All clear. Am I being brainwashed? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Chris Redfield? Uh, yeah, I guess so. He looks so different. Yeah, he's... Gosh, let me think. So he went from having his, like, weird, like, oh, like borderline pompadour hair and, like, RE1. Let's see here. Was he depicted in 2 at all? I don't think so. Wait, when did he show up again? Hey, Doc. You didn't see him until 5, did you? Or no, wait, he was in Code Veronica. That's right. Yeah, he looked weird in Code no Veronica. We'll be there. He had to look for 5. That was, the, that was doc. the doc. She'll see us next week. Hey now, think positively, all right? In seven, they we made him weird. This. I don't. I, I don't remember what he looked like at the end of seven. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You, you matter. matter. You just me. What, what are you talking about? about? Is there something, something you're not telling, not telling me? me? Come on, talk, talk to me. To Damn it! <laughs> I have to I have take, to take this. this. <laughs> Work is literally calling. Sorry, babe. Says I gotta take this. That's some. That's some incisive dialogue. We matter. Oh no, work's calling. 
Well, whatever. It was a delusion. It was a dream sequence. It's not supposed to be literal. Jesus. Alright, I'm digging it. Good. It looks great. Yeah, it looks really, really good. Oh, yes, sir. Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose. Fuck. Secure channel on an iPhone? Whatever. Well, whatever. All right, boys. We're going to 7-Eleven and buying track phones for our official communications. I don't want any loose info on unencrypted lines, boys. Ooh, there's like... Yeah. I think there's motion, motion blur on. That looks funky. Something's funky. I don't remember seeing a blur. Oh. Bloom, maybe? Huh. I don't know what... That looks... Hey. It does seem like there is some kind of, like, frame blurring going on. Why is the image quality at two? Because two is higher than one. That, that's really it. I don't know. Eliminate target recovery body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two Winterses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers accompany them. I guess Mia, like... Maybe Mia was a, an agent for Umbrella. Ella, Ella. Maybe. Maybe I'd been hoodwinked and tricked. Bamboozled. Can't trust anyone. Especially somebody who gets uh, protective of soup. Come on, it's liquid. It's like bean water. This is just what, <laughs> this is what Ethan's mad about. He didn't get to have any bean soup. I feel like I'm not supposed to just trudge into the darkness, but... Hey, what else are we gonna do? Is this st straight up how you, like, find the castle? You're just stumbling through the wilderness and you find a spooky castle? That would be sick. Staying for dinner? Good. What if Mia was Jill Valentine all along? But that means Jill got laid. Which can't happen in the Resident Evil universe. I just re Wait, so wait a minute. Um, well, no, Jake exists, so Wesker fucked. Oh, no, wait, no, it was like in vitro fertilization or whatever. Is the presence of Rosemary... Oh, you, you wuss. Is that the first... Is that the first legitimate acknowledgement of character fucking that has ever happened in Resident Evil? Because I think it might be. They had to have intercourse. It had to have happened. Ethan would be the first character to fuck, right? Unless... There's been another one? Sherry? Sherry Birkin? Wait, who's... Oh. <laughs> Chris fucked a boulder. <laughs> Barry? Barry got to have sex? Wait, Sherry is the daughter of Barry? Are you, are you for real? <sighs> ah! Who made a tiny little noose for a bird? That's just unnecessarily cruel. And so many. <sighs> Barry's kid was in RE Revelations 2. Oh, okay. All right. Then yeah. Barry was in RE 1, right? So... Bird, bird, bird. Jesus. Some birds don't respect serious discussions of lore. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Wait, what's up, Ned Lobster? Oh, come on. I saw a butt. I distinctly saw a butt. A little booty shimmering away from me. Oh, great. Of course. All right. Man, being outdoors sucks! 
God, who would do this? Who would do this? It does seem like... I think what it is, is I think there's some intentional, like, smoothing and, excel and, and input acceleration and stuff to make it... To, to be able to let you do these, like, really kind of flowy cinematic sweeps, even with a mouse. I noticed that with the controller. The controls were pretty, like, they were kind of laggy, really. Which, in a game like this, you know, is not the worst. If I'm just filing through drawers and stuff and occasionally trying to land headshots. But it's just interesting that it's sort of, I think it's sort of forced. It's just part of the engine and the way it looks. Although, I didn't feel like, uh... I didn't feel like Ghouls and Ghosts had, like, a lot of input, like, built in, so I think it might just be the, the post-processing they have on it. Fake camera and hand effect? Eh. It's more just, like, input smoothing. Um, so, like... Uh... A game like Doom Eternal will just take your mouse input and translate it directly to the game, so you feel very much in control and, like, rooted, and, f and it's fast and responsive. But if you want a camera to move more smooth, more smoothly, and like and like accelerate and decelerate and like a gradual ramp, um, you have to like set the camera motion a frame or two behind the inputs because you need to like see where to predict. You need to know what you're flowing into. So I think something like this is like it's taking a couple of game frames to interpolate inputs. I think, which is you know, it's input smoothing. A lot of like almost all games used to do it, um, and then they made it so you could turn it off, which was great. But I, maybe, well, maybe there's a, uh, you know what, maybe there's a control for it. Let me see. No, it doesn't seem like it. That's something that really only matters on, uh, on PC. It's kind of hard to tell that it happens with a c controller. But, like, there's a difference between the camera or aiming in The Last of Us Part Two versus, like, Call of Duty or something like that. Um... Okay, yeah. Aiming acceleration with controller. Camera speed on controller. No, not on the camera sensitivity. All sensitivity. Camera wobble. Yeah, so there are acceleration settings, but they're only available for controller. Which is, is usually how it is. Uh, usually that sort of thing feels a lot better with a controller than it does with a mouse. But it doesn't seem like they have settings for that. If you... Oh, okay, uh, if you up the sensitivity to like 10, it takes, a, it takes that away? Okay. That doesn't actually feel... I mean, I guess? Yeah, that's a, that's a little more immediate, actually. But, like, you can you can kind of... You can sort of see the difference in, in the way the camera moves. I changed the wrong one. Oops, okay. Aiming and movement, mouse sensitivities for menu. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. Wait, for this menu? I did change the wrong one. So wait. Up those two 10s and 11s? Wait. 10s to 11s. Oh, you just turned them to 11. I see what you mean. Okay, that is actually, yeah, shockingly remarkably different. Oh wow, that is incredibly different. All right. Okay. Yeah, that is that is a much more uh, FPS. There's, there's still just a teensy bit teensy bit on it, but that's much more of an FPS mouse control for sure. It's why it's it's so interesting to see how like even on a base level the way that different games will interpret your inputs in different ways to create different effects. I am I honestly kinda don't necess okay, so this is where sensitivity's crazy high. <laughs> is that it must be that one too, maybe? Now sensitivity for spinning around, uh, spinning around object sequences. Yeah, <laughs> okay, that's the sensitivity for that. Oh, okay, figuring it out. Oh, 
This is the glory of PC. You have no time to get scared because you're too busy obsessing about... <laughs> ...mysterious integers in the options menu. <sighs> What's not an item in here I have to get? I'm just gonna get scared? And then turn around? And there was no scare behind me? Well, that's just confusing. Ah, scare! I was facing the wrong way. Dead sh soldier should have a gun? Sure. Ooh. Hearing stompies in like a floor above you. That's a really spooky sound always. It's Chris's massive wolf dong, yeah, slamming every stair as he runs up. Boo, 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 boo. What did all this? The poor guy suffers terrible bruising dragging that thing around. Can I pick up items yet? No, never mind. Game hasn't started yet. Still gotta get scared a little bit. Oh, look at the sun's coming up. Nothing scary happens when the sun's up. Ethan just has the worst luck. Yeah, what got him involved in all this? Was it he just randomly got in a relationship with Mia and then suddenly the he's thrust into Resident Evil verse? Sick. I love how the bird kind of drags your eyes up. So look at the castle, all right? It's been a long time making this spooky castle. Look at it. I'm looking at it. It's beautiful, Capcom. You did a great job. I appreciate the bird, too. You can't... Mm, is there an FOV hack for this game already? I remember seeing some people... I mean, even even the PS5 version, the FOV was... was, was tunneled out. This, this could use a nudge. But I don't recall seeing FOV in the camera options. Mia is the resident. Ah. So Ethan's the evil. I see. I see. He couldn't continue the Bloodfield Red Line, so Chris is taking the initiative. Yeah. It's, you'd think it wouldn't be hard. Which I guess is the problem in the end of things, but... The Redfield Bloodline is in, in danger. And somebody's gotta... Gotta keep it going. I love that meme so much. It It, it is... It's amazing because, maybe, maybe they're out. but for the fact that it is sexual, it could actually be a Resident Evil storyline. And that, that just doesn't happen here. We're all about, I don't know, needles and modifying DNA and stuff. Injecting things. Oh, there's already an FOV hack slash trainer. Click. I'm gonna guess that that if it's just a, a trainer, it probably it probably bops some cutscene framing. That's what I've noticed. Is any game that has cutscenes is like if you start whacking out the FOV, it makes the cutscenes all broken. Because they are, or they <laughs> they usually make them reasonably assuming that uh, they have a certain framing, which only makes sense. Gosh, could you imagine releasing a movie and then letting the audience just change a number and then suddenly they like swap lenses on your cameras? That must be frustrating as hell. Where the hell? Is there a lockpick outside? I guess I just keep going. Fine. I guess it's all some kind of village. Man, there's some chilled beer in there. Knock back some juice, eat a little flour. I missed something? Really? I don't need it. You know what? I don't need it. I don't care. Or was I supposed to have the lockpick already? Did I just blaze right past it? That I'm with Jurassic Park. A tall, taller version of the frame was available, so people got that for some reason. Just some boom and mic and such. Oh, okay. That's mysterious. What happened? This place does look really cool. And for sure, uh vibes of like entering that ca that you know what even the soundtrack is a little resident evil -y. 
Oh, I missed a spooky moment. A corpse got dragged away. Oh, okay. <laughs> you missed the rocket launcher. <laughs> I do remember Resident Evil 4 in the town once, like, once the, the, the Ganados, I guess, had gotten alerted. It did have that sort of, like, looming intense sound effect. That just sort of was this kind of, like, low roaring noise. Listen, I missed the spook the first time. I missed the spooky the first time. Shouldn't be saying that. Uh, but this is merely the first playthrough. There's 18 more difficulties ahead of me. Damn it. There we go. Let's see. I've not yet realized I can break boxes after doing it for an entire game. Show me your tutorials and I will read them. VR and this would kill me. Did they just run out of the house? Finally, I can get my soup. Did, uh... Seven was the first and only VR game I've played through. Like, fully in VR. I wanted Squadrons to be the second one. I need to, I need to just pick a day. <clears throat> clear my Clear my calendar. Cancel my calls. Alex, you're right. Yep, Alex. Shit. Oh, Ethan's got scared. Yorp. Is there something behind this <laughs> c -c -c curtain? Unslashable curtain? Kevlar, Kevlar curtain. Ah! No, no, friendly, friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road. And... What's going on? Oh no! They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Free gun! Okay. Hell yeah, this village rules. Hey, are you listening? Hey! Could have dropped your shotgun, jerk. What the? Now I'm gonna have to find it by, I don't know, inserting medallions into some kind of giant puzzle. Dead body? Wait, there's more. Now that's spooky. Alright, okay. Always gotta check behind. That's where the green herbs are, back there. Dun, 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 Hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Come on. Put a little razzle-dazzle in the game. What the hell is wrong with this place? You know what this game's problem is? <laughs> it's too dark. Needs a little needs a little song and dance. <laughs> Did I fall into like the Wolfman ball pit? Cool! What is with Ethan's left hand? He cannot take that thing through a game. What was that? Yeah, right? No. I really like this this trend of ripping off Ethan's left hand in the worst possible ways. Little sprinkle sprinkle, let's solve that. Oh, right, I forgot about guarding. You do that in this game. What the hell? Give him a little, 
Give him a little one of these. How you doing? <coughs> well, how do you do? <laughs> this has to be Florida. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's 2 p.m. and there's a wolf man attacking somebody at the Cracker Barrel. Oh. You okay, mister? I'm gonna borrow your gun. You ever feel like they, well, does it really matter if they like mix up the, <laughs> the key items or the healing items or whatever? Bolt cutters, batteries, keys. I guess they do to some degree. Gems. Cranks. That was a thing for a while. I feel like it's been a while since I've had a good old fashioned Resident Evil crank. Aside from the remakes, of course. Yay. Yay. Nothing makes me feel more celebrated than a tiny little rectangle sliding up telling me I've done something. Uh, I feel like Steam has put a lot of pizzazz into the rest of the storefront since, like, the Epic Game Store launched. But they still haven't really put a lot of razzle-dazzle on their, their Steam achievement pop-ups or animations or anything. I mean, there's not even a custom sound for it, is it? I guess that's my job. I'm supposed to give it a sound and make it like a five minute quote from Death Note. I need to make my Steam sound like a Counter Strike, <laughs> random Counter Strike server from 2009. I kind of prefer Steam achievements being out of the way. Yeah, I, I don't mind it. So much of, well, Steam's gotten tons better. In the last couple of years, I'll 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 give them credit for that, but uh, yeah, most of the time I just want Steam to get out of the way. So can't argue with that. It'd be worse if they were like big and loud and stupid and annoying and you couldn't turn them off. Hey. <sighs> This was some Call of Duty guitar riffs. Oh, that'd be a sick level up sound. Or maybe like Steam message sound. I used to have just, I maybe like most people, when I got my own PC, and I went a little hams, throwing dumb sound effects on everything. I made myself giggle like twice, and then it got so annoying. <laughs> it's like, I don't care, I'd turn it all off. Ah! Not today, Wolf Man. Although, Oh, maybe today, Wolfman. That's weird that they're they're just Wolfmen right now. Like, there's no basic zombie, so they have to kite. Like, it feels like they can't just throw a bunch of fodder at you for you to wade through a bunch of easy to headshot zombies. That's super true. I would not like it more if they inserted themselves by force into the game's experience. Ah, uh, okay. That's fair. I think yeah. I think that's. It's, that's the better. That's the better outcome for sure. Ah, Wolfman! I guess I wasn't blocking. Are they hangry? He does a pretty good little dance, wiggling up to you. Actually, makes it pretty hard to headshot him reliably. gonna get real desperate if they have exactly one more wolf is it over yeah it's probably over <laughs> dun 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 credits dun 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 if there are any survivors resident evil village to louise's house near the field how much do you think it would cost to make a game that was that long and then to uh 
How much do you think it, sh it would cost? Like, if you could just make a five, like a ten minute game with a ridiculous engine and like a, a big spooky house of werewolves. <gasps> I'd pay like five dollars for that if it looked this cool. Probably. Look at how pretty that is. And you'd be like, damn, why'd they make this whole village for a short game? I don't know. They did, though. Uh oh, there's oh shit. There's just wolf men. Just, there's just wolf men hanging out. That's weird. You could just see them. They're just chilling. Uh, do I have to like find a way to walk through the vil Resident Evil Village TM without angering the wolf men? Didn't expect there to be like a a pathing puzzle. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hello, wolf man. Objective run? Yeah, maybe maybe I just need to sprint through all this, but I don't know where I'm going. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. Right, okay. Maybe I come back here after I get some more effective... Oh, that's a wolf man. Uh... All right, Wolfman. We're gonna no, no. I was just. Oh boy. Okay. All right, Wolfman. Oh. Ooh. This is kind of this is kind of neat though. This is sort of like a eh, sort of like a a redo of the the like the village sequence in four. Oh boy, I do not have the resources to fight you. Ow. But that's kind of how it was. I remember in harder difficulties, you had to just kind of run away. Which is sort of neat. I guess it depends whether or not they can... Uh, they can get me when I'm at a full sprint. Oh, fuck. Is that a crank? You're going to do that to me right now? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I could have crafted bullets. Oh, I'm getting I'm getting Resident Evil. That's tough, man. <laughs> Ethan's not slowed down by having the weight of all of his fingers. Yeah, that's a lot of drag. You don't have to worry about. Oh, I can I can make bullets. All right. And I will. Oh no, wait, never mind. It says I need two of each of those things, and I have neither of them. I cannot make bullets. I. I mistook can for cannot. Classic mistake. Hmm. So wait, do I get to leave this? Okay, that's the checkpoint. Is it over? First person versus third for Resident Evil games. I think they they both I think they both work. I think they both have their pluses and minuses. This is a very it's a very non-answer, but I like that they've experimented with both. No, 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 no. Uh, so they slowly get up when they're about to, to chase you. I really don't know if it's expected that I can, like, fight my way through these guys. It doesn't seem like it. They're really not giving me enough resources to, to do that. But I don't know what my options are. Oh, come on, man! Smash and grab from the boxes? Yeah, it may end up being that. Survive the attack. I mean, that's the objective. It's just survive, so... Uh, and I'm not going... I'm probably not going to. So now that I'm hurt... Alright. Yeah, I guess you just have to, like... I guess you just have to be harried by them. You have to be chased. 
I should have conserved your bullets. I, get, I mean, I did miss some shots. Oh, yeah, I did do that. But I don't... I think... Uh, no amount of, of elite headshotting would uh, deliver unto me the amount of bullets I need. Over? To fight all of those wolfmans. Do you have enough herbs to make some pots? Maybe. You also missed some fingers. I did. You're right. I do have some to make some... What is with this menu? Wait, I don't. Never mind. I already made it. And used it. Which could be the problem as well. I'm just curious if, like, are they gonna send one after me if enough time goes by? It really doesn't seem like there's a way to, uh, to not get on a wolf man's angry at me. <sighs> less fingers means less of you they can hit. You're right. It makes my hitbox smaller. Made it back into here. That doesn't mean much, I don't think. Am I supposed to be backtracking right now? I remember there being a box I couldn't break, but I don't quite remember where. Probably won't like loud noises. That's true. If they got puppy dog ears. Probably wouldn't like a bang bang from a gun. Well, okay then. <laughs> I guess there's really nothing back here that I can see. Great, good. <sighs> yeah, I guess they really intend for you to just try and sprint through it, I guess. Okay, well, I mean, there's that crank thing, too, so I feel like I have to get into these buildings and look for that... Look for whatever item I need. Maybe it's not that hard to... Wait, he moved. Oh, there's one up there. Maybe I can, like, sneak... Sneak here? You don't see me, it's fine. Just, just gotta, gotta keep John Cena... Okay. Oops. What is that? What? Oh, I think they just make scary sounds. Wouldn't they be able to smell me? Oh boy. Alright. Well, I guess the answer might be yes. Damn it. Can they come down here? They can probably come down here. Knife bags, maybe? Ah, uh, hi. Okay, right. Wow. Just ran past the shotgun on the table. I was getting chased by werewolves. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> yeah, this is this is pretty rough. Um I mean, I guess I'm figuring out that they want you to, like, stealth through this section, which is a little strange. But I'm figuring it out. I'm figuring it out slowly. I did stab that one, so that's, that's... Over. That's an improvement. Ran past the rocket launcher as well. Damn. That would make that w that would make this way easier. Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my... to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? They could just run? Maybe? 
you, there's like a puzzle there specifically designed to not let you sprint through, though. Ah. I mean, this does remind me, like, I guess the idea is this is kind of like uh, the beggars chasing you around their house, you know? <clears throat> now your ammo. Yeah, I just... What the fuck? I just need to get a better idea of what they expect of me. Fuck! Okay, so the sound is what's cueing them in, I think. Okay. There we go. Yeah. All right. Shotgun acquired. Someday. Okay. Damn it. All right. Okay. Wait. Flower bags. What? Attack flower bags to create a cattle cover. Okay. Ah. Uh. Okay, now I know what the flower bags do. I wonder if you can slash them. Uh, eh! Yes, you can. That's cool. Ah! There we go. Yeah, now we're doing it. Okay, okay. There's no end to them. I like. Uh. That's right, strategist. Bong. Just like an RE4, yeah, right? Oh! Holy frick! Crystal Skull, what? Oh no, this is not the way to go. Oh. We stop in the middle of this tense moment to craft a first aid med and a bullet or two. Run! I'm not sure. I feel like I. I'm off the, uh, the intended path at this point. I can never tell when they're gonna hit. That's a good point. No. Damn it! It's really hard to hit them. You're kidding me. I'm learning. I'm learning. Yep, yeah, you're dead. That's so many. It's so many. Yeah, I got Vord. I I mean, I was kind of hoping. Um, I was kind of hoping Wolf Chris would be my first, but that's okay. <gasps> Is it over? Hey, what's up, tube of toothpaste? Where's your big woman? Oh. Haven't made it to Big Lady yet. Gotta gotta get through the Wolf Man's first. The wolf hordes of Transylvania. Uh. We're speedrunning this shit now. Okay. Damn it. These frames are getting pretty chonky. Combat situations. Maybe RTX. Maybe RTX is a little, a little much. Maybe, maybe. 
Bad idea. Okay, so I think I think Flower's probably pretty uniquely for getting away. Jeez. is kind of pointless at this point. I just need to survive. I'm trying to get a get a sense for like if the enemies drop anything, if there's a reason to engage in combat. Just, just feeling out the rules. Same old. Picking up the scrap. Alright, alright, let's let's crouch and move forward. There we go. Did he get in? No? Okay. That seems scary. God, there's like... It's almost... It almost feels a little bit like GTA movement sometimes where like... You let go of a movement direction and then you hit it again. But the... Like you're in the middle of a slowing down animation so you have to wait for that to finish before it'll let you start moving in the direction you hit again. Ugh! So, like, there's a lot of, like, uh, like, it takes a bit to get Ethan moving in any direction. It's weird. There's, like, I want to say a good tenth of a second pause between hitting, hitting W and, like, speeding up and moving. Which feels a little, a little muddy. You're kidding me. Jesus, that's a lot. Uh, okay. That is a big man. He's making angry sound. I never unlocked this. I am dead. Maybe? Ah, uh, fuck! Ugh, this frames. Yowza. Yeah, maybe I gotta... Maybe I gotta dial back some of the... Some of the graphics. This is so big. Am I just am I just running laps now? Maybe that'll work. This is quite the bump from seven. Oh, and, oh! I feel like his head popped. Oh, damn it! Thought I could hang around, pick up the item. Foolish. Crouch. Man, the controls are not great. <laughs> I'm gonna be real, like... Well, let me turn off ray tracing and see if that helps. It's like... It can't blend a lot of inputs. If I'm holding one thing, it won't let me do another. So if I'm holding shift and forward to sprint, and I hit C, nothing happens. You gotta let go of W and then hit C, and then hit D... Hmm. Hold on a second. All right, all right, fine. Let's see what that does. I put it on hard. Yeah, no, I'm fine with that. Uh, I accept that part of it. It's um, hard. Hard doesn't make it so that Ethan accelerates like half a second after I want him to. Yeah, that. Yes, this is this is this is much more uh, much more normal. Doesn't look as cool though. Look at that sweet ray tracing. Maybe the future was maybe the future was too far in the future. Think your 87k is bottlenecking the 3080? Maybe? I don't know. Games still very rarely uh, hit maximum CPU usage. Although it's been it's been happening 
It happened with Cyberpunk, actually. Cyberpunk's the only game I've seen hit 100% CPU, so it may be... I, I think... No, I, I am waiting for it for Intel's next line. Or maybe I should just go with AMD, I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, it's. It, I think it is time to upgrade the CPU, which, which means upgrading the motherboard, which means reinstalling Windows, which means reinstalling everything else. Which, that's gonna that'll be a nice little weekend project. I don't, really, I don't need to use this yet, so I should. Gosh. That, that crouch is so particular. Ah! <laughs> Shut the door! Fuck! Oh, God! There's no end to them. Can I maybe craft a Blamo? Oh, certainly. Um, there, there, in fact, is craft a Blamo. At least I think. Yeah, no, I, I pick up gunpowder and stuff. It's only like five bullets. My issue is not that I'm running out of ammo. It's that I can't kill enemies fast enough to stop from being overwhelmed. They close on you so fast, it's- they, like, lumber around really awkwardly. So they'll be at range, and then they'll just zoom, zoom up to you. I'm learning, though, I'm learning. Pick up money through the fence, that's something. Let's play ring around the cook pot. Ow! <sighs> and then you go slower, which basically means you're screwed. Hello, big boy. There we go. I haven't even been able to find the, like, item I'm supposed to use on that door, which I presume I'm supposed to go through. Um, I don't know, the, the objective does just say survive, and I think this is, this feels like it's supposed to be a reference or an homage to the opening of four. You need to go where the big guy comes from. Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Did you get the bolt cutters? Yeah, maybe. Maybe try sneaking around. I don't, it doesn't seem like it's possible. Um, anywhere I go, there's wolfmen kind of staring from the from the rooftops. And when you go into this house specifically, a one that has a gun that you seem to need, you you make some sound by stepping on this stuff. There's really no way to avoid it. So it's and there's a whole mechanic around barricading the doors. So I don't know that they intend for you to stealth through this sequence. It also doesn't okay. feel like Damn it. something they would do this early in the game, but I could be wrong about that. Pretty good at picking up these items, though. See you later, pops. Try going pass the big man. I will. Hit C very gingerly. Big man seems to show up after a certain amount of time, or like a certain escalation. I'm not sure, but. Rolling through these areas seems to seems to do it. There's no end to them. Any big spooky so far? A fair amount. A fair amount. I'm still learning myself. 
taking my first steps on my path to becoming a Resident Evil Master. Oh boy, I missed! Holy cow! You're not allowed to do anything wrong! I mean, I am playing on hard. It seems to tie him to the amount of fire in the village. It seems like going through that one house causes it to get more fiery, though. Man. It's a neat sequence. It's just... It's weird that they would drop, drop something like that right away. Interesting. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go unlock that door this time too. Over. Can you go through the basement to the shotgun room, avoiding the glass on the floor? Let me, let me see. I doubt it, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna see. And is it? Is that it? No, oh, I can't hit. Come around that side, a wolfman jumps out. And then everybody's mad. So I I'm pretty certain it's it's like meant to be this way. You're supposed to get supposed to get chased by the verves. Ah! And there's a wolfman in here already. Alright. Have your way with me, Wolfman. This is what I came for, Wolfman. Do it! I read the streamer stuck in this part, too. <laughs> I, think, I think I've got it figured out. I've just gotta, like, not get hit by any zombie. I, I, I've got it. I think I know, I think I know what they want. I think I know what they're trying to do. I think I, can, I speak Resident Evil enough. Yeah, this it's it's meant to be a big homage to four, and I'm okay with that. It's a neat sequence too. It's just tell it's kind of telegraphed a little weird, and usually there's like there's very little ramp up, which is interesting. Over the ramp up was like a, a, a linear narrative sequence. Well, I guess not. It wasn't that linear. I got to wander around the house, but that's kind of a weird uncharted opening. Usually they have a sort of rising action sequence. You get to kill. You have your first encounter with your first zombie and like a. Uh, a sort of like contained space. Unlock the door. Ah, shit! I didn't unlock the door. Okay. So they're they're like trying to mix up the the, the progression, but I think I think the progression was there because it worked and it like really introduced things in a natural order. But whatever, man. Mixing it up, it's fine. Oh, there's no reason for me to be to wait for the flower. If I leave the flower bags there, I might be able to use them later. Because it seems like I'm going to have to really... Uh, I didn't pick up that other thing. I'm going to have to be really judicious about using... Did I pick it up? Man! God, it takes so fucking long for items to drop. Jesus. You have to just sit there and wait for the animation and then the item to manifest. And then you have to be mashing F while you're looking... Ah. I, to, I think I think it's more like I have to keep looking at it. I can't assume that I'm just gonna pick it up if I'm like mashing F and walking There's over no it. Okay, that makes it harder because I'll have to do more more wild mouse motions. I'm just dialing into the quirks of the game, and this game's pretty quirky already. RE4 was like that. Okay. Yet. Well, no, you're right. The village. Well, there's arrows, but the village isn't super on. Fa How is he already on the roof waiting for me? Man. Hold on a minute. I think I can. There we go. The item drops instantly. Just sometimes you're too close to the item, so the item doesn't give you the pickup prompt. Gotcha. Okay. Good to know. Good to know.
Open! Okay, there's, there's Big Man. Yeah, okay, yeah. I guess he clears... He clears the tree. Dude! I just want to sprint past and see what's going on. If, if they'll let me. Oh. Whoa. I got a treasure. Great. Oh, I'm still alive. Oh, oh no. Okay. Yeah, what if they want you to kill him because he has the key? Yeah, maybe? Maybe I gotta lure him to the explosive barrel. Um, but he did. Yeah, I guess he does seem to chase. So maybe I gotta figure out how to kite these guys. This is, this is on, uh, yeah, this is on hardcore. Yeah. Let me actually put that in the title. I didn't know what difficulties would be available uh, right away, so. But you know what? You can live life on easy mode because there's a miraculous product out there at 30% off, and I think I hear it calling to me in the distance. Oh, that's right. It's a 30% off weekend for G Fuel. Is it so if you want 30% off, go ahead and use my code. Do you feel sponsoring me, by the way? Is that an any related to RE4? I, it's super thematically related. Um, well, I shouldn't say thematically. Maybe more in, in style. Aesthetically related, we'll say that. Because, yeah, this, this is just like, it's a super, this feels like a 4K version of the opening to 4, where you're in that European village getting harried by the Las Plagas. Which is a super sick sequence, uh, and this one is also cool, but it's a little chunkier. I think it's because they wanted, maybe wanted you to feel more like you were, you were finding your way and being scrappy and stuff. Um, instead of giving you like a big playground of a, of a European village to, to sprint through. Also, yeah, I'm, I'm playing on hardcore, so it's gonna do something. It's gonna do something to the difficulty curve a little bit. Thank you, Artie Plays. I like to put a little, I like to put my own little seasoning, my own little secret sauce on it whenever I do sponsorships and stuff, so. <laughs> I like to jazz it up a little bit. I always want to make sure that ads make streams more fun in some kind of way. The sound design is very good, though, Yondo. No complaints there. Hey! Oh, is the Florida Panthers? Yeah. I think that's that's how I found the sound effect. It was the Florida Panthers yowl on, on YouTube. Oh, come on, bro! Wow! I got surrounded instantly. Okay, well, there's only one this way. Oh, I got a craft. Gotta move! Gotta move. Eh? 
Hey. I don't want to use the barrel already. Swing around here and unlock the door. Yeah. You gotta have some barrel strats. Can't come. Oh, I already did. I was thinking ahead. Good for me. Whoa, oh, there's a quick turn. Good to know. Good to know. I hit it on accident. Oh, they never broke through? Oh, Jesus, guys. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, maybe I should wait around. can hit me up here, so. Wow. There, I guess that's the other thing. Like, I don't recall there being a lot of, a lot of, like, dead-end death traps in that sequence in 4. It was, it, there were, like, there was a way, there was, like, a way out of most situations, whereas I keep getting trapped in, like, in dead-end alleyways and places with no exit, so I have to take damage or try to shoot through, and man, these guys do not die. Is it? Supposed to use the water wheel and his ride to safety. <laughs> I'll use the wheel. This looks frustrating. I'm playing on. I'm playing on a hard difficulty. I want to. I want to. The game deserves acknowledgement and credit of that. But I'm learning. I have to watch them break the damn thing so that my my routes can be preserved. up every okay. single item in a specific sequence. Yeah, it just to survive the attack. I'm pretty sure I just gotta just gotta hang ten, hang tough. Well I guess if I wait for them to come into this room, then I know that they've broken in. Okay. Right. I'll save that for the second <laughs> the second path through here. Yeah I'm basically gonna have to like just have a have a route that I run and hopefully it will keep me away from Wolfman's long enough. <laughs> I swear I plugged him with a shotgun shell. Usually it's just like one shotgun blast. Oh, usually it's like one shotgun blast plus a nice headshot and that'll do it, but not today. There's no end to them. There's no end to them. Wolfmen are wily. Yeah, they actually, they they do have some pretty, uh, like, pretty challenging movement patterns. Um, say that. Ah! There was a body in the way, so I couldn't get in front of the ladder. So I turned into the wolfman who chomped me. window on that side like look at them they're actually like surrounding the house it's it's pretty cool to see I think it's cool to see jeez they're all just like popping out at this choke point I'm surprised I'm surprised I didn't get hit like there's another is this another dead end I mean I guess I can go around the, the hay but like there's multiple choke points I just there's so many guys. I'm pretty sure they circle you at some point. Yeah, I mean, they're pretty good about it. Um, they would just, uh, 
in older dumber video games, they just sort of like fall in line single file and try to chase you. So you could just kite them all day and use that to pick them off one at a time. No longer. Games have upgraded. Come on, you. Come on, you. Is it over? If you want a tip, I can give you one. I think I'm close to figuring it out. It's... Hmm. There's just a, a lot of volatility. Yeah, this is this is hardcore difficulty. You know, Grandpa. Let me let me bash my head against it just a little bit more. Damn it. Calculated. It's like I'm Jason Bourne moving around with intention. Shift makes you stand. Like, uh, I swear to God, that one gets in sometimes. There's no end to them. I should just save the barrel for later, too. <laughs> Bro! Man. These guys are killers. And they all spill out over here. Yep. the streamers on hardcore have been stuck on this part for a while so you're not alone i mean i think if it if i i i swear it's got to be like time based although big man hasn't busted in yet although the the strings are starting to kick up so there's a little bit of that now i wonder if are they actually going to be down there like waiting for me because i feel like the answer to that's probably going to be yes Holy shit! I was like, surely this guy's gonna die, right? No, no, no. I don't know why I bother. I, again, playing on hard. Don't judge the game based entirely on this, playing on hard. Waiting for me. Wow. Oh, come on. Oh, man. Oh. Knew that one would be there. Yeah, I mean, I've run it in before, I guess. I didn't think he would just stand there, though. I don't know if it's the same one. He wouldn't just immediately hit me again. Great! I didn't even see that one. Wow. There was one right there. I like looked in three directions and there was a guy just like waiting for me, just pointing at me. <laughs> He's like, you. Huh. If the roof only has one dude, maybe that's safer. I, I can... I think going up to the roof is probably a good idea. 
because at least I mean they actually no wait they crawl up the side never mind um, but it does seem like at least they can't swarm you up there and the hammer man can't reach you it seems so maybe I'll I'll make a I'll make a couple laps I'll pick up all the ammo I can find and then I'll, I'll try to make a stand up there oh man getting away from these these guys is is real 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 challenging they did a if they did a good job making them just horrifically menacing because they will get you man they will get you like at a certain point resident evil zombies aren't anything okay, anymore it. it's just like okay they're just just like fun little things to practice shooting unless they're you're in like a specific situation I don't feel cinematic, so maybe a holdout spot? Uh, which one? There's only so many... Only so many dressers you can shove in front of, uh, doorways. There's that there. Maybe you can shoot through it? That box is just unsafe to go for. That's a weird thing to say. Shamblers that if you shoot wrong will nibble you. These guys actually feel like they're coming. Oh, yeah. They are coming for me. That's for sure. There's no way to them. God damn it! <laughs> I thought I would have... Man, I thought I would have some time. No. No time. It's also like it's a weird intro sequence because since they you run away from everything you don't see anything when it hits you and that's a weird way to introduce combat to basically ask you to not look at the things that are going to telegraph damage to you or do damage to you that guy's still over there So now I can't get back into that house, though. Like, ever. Unless they just decide to break that for me. Or maybe I can, like, cut it with a knife. Get your ass! Damn, they get your ass! They get it! They have declared that ass is mine, and then they come for it, and they take it. Jesus Christ. <sighs> uh, are any RTX options? They were on for a while, but the performance was not great, so I turned it off. I probably need to, like, turn on. I don't know if this game has, um, whatever the thing is. AI upres deal. Are any survivors out there? Come to my to Louisa's house near the DLSS, that's the one, thank survivors? you. Survivors? Yeah, that's the one. I couldn't remember the acronym. My ass has been too tenderized by wolf men. <laughs> Which is now that I think about it, exactly what I was hoping for from Resident Evil Village. <clears throat> Bit of an ass pounding from a wolf man. Oh, it's got AMD scum version of the LSS? Okay. Was it like Chris Stamix or something like that? Smooth view. It starts with a C, right? Cass? C A S? Okay. Damn it. Keep wanting to watch, but don't wanna wait till I get it so I can solve it on my own. Uh yeah, are you planning on playing on hardcore? 
They, uh, hardcore is pretty spicy right off the bat. Right off the bat. Fidelity FX Super Revolution. That's the one. Thank you. There it is. I'm gonna guess there's probably... <laughs> I'm gonna guess there's probably uh, more houses that have the, the bookshelf that I can push. I feel like that would buy me more time. I can probably also go through windows and, like, circle through houses that way. That might be a way that I can, like, shake off zombie pursuers. This was a terrible house to come inside. Maybe not. Ah, ha, ha. I thought I could give him the old rope-a-dope, but that's not happening. Okay, this also is another death trap of a house, so that's good. They never... That was cool. That was cool. Shit, man. They never busted through this. Oh, I can, I can move it from the inside. Okay. Go over the side, Ethan. Oh, I guess he doesn't do that. What is this? Some, is this Leon S. Kennedy all of a sudden? No. It's a fine specimen of a man to be able to vault over a waist high. Man, they just wait for you. Oh! I can't if I if I try to ring around the rosy there'll just be another one that hits me. It's just like nothing but dead ends, man. It's 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 pretty cruel. Okay, there's still an explosive barrel up here. Fuck! God! They're everywhere! Now I can't move! I'm fucked! There's gotta be... They ha- like, I have to be able to go somewhere! Right? Ugh, man. Have you tried parlaying? I have not communicated with the werewolves. That's on me. <gasps> Wait, audio crackle? Is is it like overloading? Oh, I think it's probably overloading. Is it? The audio peaks okay. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, it looks like it was way too loud. Learn to parry. This game has parries? They certainly haven't told me about that yet. Actually, I think I did parry at one point. I thought I saw him like push back an enemy that was lunging at him. What happened to his pinky finger? Got chewed off by a dog man. Damn it. <laughs> Do a sick ass Dark Souls fat roll. Yeah. Wump! I mean, at this point, it feels like that's what Ethan would do. He'd just splatter on the ground, dislocate a hip. I don't know 
order to understand the wolfmen, you must know what they want. What do you want, wolfman? Yeah, this hand's been chopped off before. It's the same hand. I missed, I missed the turn by like a second and there was already a guy eating me. This game does not F around. There's no way to them. Is the same MC7? Yeah, it is. I mean, I never get back, I can never survive back to the stupid room once once all hell breaks loose. So maybe I need to I need to take these breaks. These little pauses where I can get them. I killed I killed 3 of them and there are already 3 more in the room. Like before the bodies even drop items, they're already on me. That's interesting. The slowdown is, is only temporary. Well, I am fully out of all ammo. I'm going to knife this flower. Wait, no, I've got some handgun ammo. Eh. <laughs> okay. I was like, oh god, I missed the ladder. Big Skeletor running away vibes, yeah. That's, that's the that's the most uh, intimidating thing I can think of for Ethan to do at this time. <laughs> Already on the roof. Already on the roof. Already three of them on the roof! I am shocked there's not 12 of them over here already. Fuck. I guess I just last stand up here. What else am I gonna do? Fuck. Hmm. Okay, I'll take that tip now. I'm 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 kind of running out of ideas. Uh, I kind of don't know what to do now. <laughs> Aside from just keep like experimenting with trying to slip the wolfmen. Even on easy, you can't win by fighting. But I don't. I only I only stop and fight when I have nothing else to do. When there's nowhere else to run to, because eventually I get harried into a uh, into a, a dead end. You have to survive five minutes. Interesting. I wonder how okay. close I'm getting. Because they just, they, they're fast and they, they run at you. They find you wherever you are. They haven't gone to the far end of the river yet. Oh, okay. The one, wait, the one where the big guy comes from? With like the big door I can't open and that's it? Or maybe is there something else? Something else down there that I didn't see. Well, here, I will, uh, I'll go down the river this time. Bro, god damn it. Like, this river here, hold on, this river here. 
Okay, so there's the water wheel. I've gone down this. I've gone down this way. I did this like two times. There's nothing down there. It's a door I can't open. And that's it. Another another dead end. I don't I don't know what you guys are talking about. Does hiding not work? There's nowhere to hide. Check out the left side of the river. You're gonna have to be way more specific and not give a relative direction. Use the barricade. Shoot the wolfmen as they are trying to break it down. Since the whole segment is time-based, you just want to drag it out. Shoot through the cracks of the barricades. Oh, okay. Why wouldn't, why wouldn't there just be a tutorial message about that? You have no reason to assume that that's the operating mechanic here. Over. Okay. All right, that makes sense. I would not have I would not have thought that in a long time ever, really. I would just assume that the barriers break over time and that's it. But it does make sense that they would have like health. It's dumb that it's a scripted fail, but you have to do a 5-minute scripted fail. Oh, well, I didn't know scripted fail. Let's find out. I just have to get to the one that matters. Oh. All right. Really? A little hop. I thought for sure I was about to get hit. I still didn't pick it up. Uh, it's interesting that you can grab items and stuff through through walls. There's no end to them. Eh. <laughs> Well, this one sucks because they get in through the window, like, right away. Oh, well, maybe not right away. I guess that means there's two things I have to defend here. Yeah, because they break through this, too. Right. Okay, well that's it. Those are the only doors I can barricade. Oh wait, no, I can go back into the original uh, the original room I was in. That still has a, a functioning shelf in it. I think. Yeah, it should. Are they gonna let me back in? Yeah. Oh, you, you, oh, you, God. The prompt kept going away. Like it was doing that thing where it would like negative edge the input. What? All right, well. It was- it had been softened up, I guess. Alright. All the time I have just earned is now gone. There are so many! There were dudes waiting in line! And they're hitting me as I'm running away at full speed! Comfortably dumb. I've done exactly what you're talking about more than once. But, you know what? Why not? I'll run down the stream again. And I'm sure this time it'll work, because you're very certain that is what is required here. I may not make it, though. I'm probably not gonna make it, because I'm already fucked. Pick up the skull, though, so that's something. Here, here we go. We're going down the river! Oh, maybe not! This guy might have something to say about it. He ran the wrong way. They're... 
There are two ends to the river comfortably dumb. I was at one of them, and here's the other one. Maybe this is an efficient troll. Okay, well, I mean, I did- I tried to keep them off the barricades. Hey, what's up, Cyber Ham Sandwich? You had one minute left. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That was four minutes? I had 20% more to go? Hmm. Okay, alright. Um, alright. Over? Alright, new plan. Um, I'm not going to move the shelves in front of doors until I've done two, a lap and picked up all the ammo that I can. Um, that way I have more bullets t to shove them off of the door. However, shoot, should I, should I spend all my ammo defending? Because the other house has entry through the basement. And I'm pretty sure they're going to just come around behind me when I cover that door. When both barricades break to a figure eight between the two houses. Okay, yeah. Um, that seems like what's necessary now. I, I feel like they're gonna cut off my figure eight and hit me, but that's how I did it. All right. That's a shit segment. Yeah, this is not. I mean, again, playing on hardcore. Blah, blah, blah. This is this is a rough way to start. Roof house has good exit with window plus Damn ladder. It. Yeah, I guess I guess you can go out of the window there. Pick up all items. Pick them all up. There's no end to them. What? No, no, no! I wanted to... Okay. Hey! Welcome, gooses. I'm playing the hit video game Resident Evil 8 Village. going very well as you can see lots of thrills and chills all right I mean I I burned a lot of time there yeah uh, I've been this is kind of the first sequence in the entire game and I've been stuck here since I started so things are going very well What's the problem is they're just waiting for me out there. And they don't get stunned by this flower. So maybe I should stun and then run past out the front. I'm gonna run past out the front door since these guys are stunned. This is maybe a little safer way to get out. You can craft some handgun ammo. I can, but I mean, the, it doesn't matter right now. God, they're, mm. So they've already surrounded me and cut me off. Um, but uh, the, the, the thing is broken, right? So. Hmm. I don't have time to reload. Holy fuck! Now I can reload. Alright. There he is. There's my guy. They don't... They just wait for you. 
<laughs> they just sit there. That was three minutes. Well, if I had made it to the other house, I probably could have bought another minute. And then I guess it's just running around like an idiot and praying. So, hmm. Is it? That was a better run, but the turnaround killed you. I, no, it didn't. I mean, that the same the same wolfman that was waiting for me outside that crawlspace was the same wolfman that hit me when I crawled out of that crawlspace. That's what killed me. Whether it happened... Be, like, I bought more time by turning around. It was still the same wolfman, though. <laughs> just sitting there. Just sitting there, waiting, patiently. Okay. Getting closer, yeah. I'm finally I'm zeroing in on a technique. Wait a minute, I wonder. Oh no way. Wait, I thought I hit him. Nope, never mind. Well, that that fucked it. I thought I hit him that one time. I was like, man, if I could just knife this one idiot through a through a door, if that could really be it. So yeah, the the trick before was I came out here early enough and there wasn't a guy waiting there. Um, but if I if I spend the right amount of time in that first house, God, turn the wrong way. There's no way to Knife works on window guy. Okay. Oops, wrong button. go. Hmm. <laughs> Shotgun works as well, yeah. I see you've stumbled upon the shotgun strategy. Oh, I didn't pick up the shells down there. Well, that's probably it for me then. Oh, maybe I can do maybe I can get some figure eights going. Sure. I mean like loop around this way oh I didn't okay but there's guys that will like come this way and cut me off better at Resident Evil than I am. Doing cheeky little dodges like that. Yep, there's... Fuck, oh, man. And he's blocking the door, so I can't... There we go. Well, wait, this was the wrong way to go. Oh, dear. Well, I mean, I picked up health, so I can at least take one one, one hit, one or two hits, and kind of shove my way through. That wasn't guard! Alright, that's fine. What? You... Wait, did I not pick up health just then? Oh, okay, I got chem fluid. I can pick up the shells now. Am I gonna make it to the ladder? I am! One more minute? Okay. I mean, I've got four shells, so that's... 
Can wait, can you get hurt on the ladder? Oh, you can? Okay. I hear a lot of cha I hear a lot of anger. You have to activate the locked door past the big wolf. Yeah? Maybe it's like you have to... You have to wait a certain amount of time and then run down there. No, ignore that. Do not. <laughs> Does it just cut to black and then you see a cutscene of, of Ethan getting his ass kicked? I'll figure it out. Whatever. We're playing Resident Evil. Have to be out in the open. I think you get hit with an arrow in the thigh. Okay, all right. Well, I mean, that's probably over five minutes, so. Did I do it? Do I, get, do I get to play the video game? All right, cool. Well, speedrunning strat identified, I guess. Jeez. You know what's a good video game when you gotta cheese it. I, I now I'm kind of curious to watch somebody who, I mean, Captain, you did it right, so you were you were just able to like bust loops. I don't know. Give him that Far Cry camera look our villain for today, boys. This is a major G Fuel moment. <laughs> you know what? You're right. As the as the wolfman cries fade into the distance, I hear nothing but a panther yowling across the across the wintry meadows. <laughs> exactly. I gotta press the G Fuel button. Come on. Just looped around, took me about four tries with the barricades as well. Man. Well, I'm glad you, uh, I'm glad it worked out for you. Wait, wait. Cowabunga, dude. Cowabunga to you too. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm going to turn RTX back on. Who needs it now? We're, we're going back into cinematic mode. Oh, okay, that's... Well... Yeah. Has to like, oh, that does. Mm, uh oh. Yeah, I don't think it. I don't think it renders. Man, it can't render at like 120 with uh, with ray tracing on. Holy cow. Ooh, is there a way to turn on FPS? How is that? Gosh, that's like so much worse than it was when it started. Ugh. Holy crap. Oh. Hold on. Okay, yeah, I mean, it's maxing out my video card. Or at least it was. Come on. Wait, what? This isn't right. Yeah, GPU's at like 37%, CPU's at 20. Yeah, something is scuffed. That's fine. That's what I was told. It makes sense. 
Man, all that, pe all that beautiful ray tracing. Uh, I guess we'll have to... Wait, this is on? Oh, wait, no, never mind. That's not the, uh, that's not the AMD, AMD business. God, it's all the way at the... Uh... Jesus Christ. Ugh, there. Playing it like that is a real hardcore mode? Man, that's what I did. That sucked. If there are any issues with performance, it's the ray tracing. It's really fucked. And honestly, with it on, it's not that noticeable. Yeah, I agree. I agree. There are other traditional lighting methods that are really, really good already, so... What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? It's you, the child's father. Child? That's some primo hey, wait, performance can capture. You Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? Isn't ray tracing supposed to make it more dynamic rather than baked Castle in? Ben sort of. Danger. That's that's They're a way to think about it, yeah. <laughs> No. Wait. Where's Rose? Traditional game Who's lighting can be dynamic too, the but bell tolls for us all. They're but yeah. coming again. <laughs> Rose is here? <laughs> she locked it. And I just watched her do it. Sure lady, do what you gotta. Do what you gotta to gate me appropriately at this point in the game. Yeah, she locked me in. There's like a clack clack, and I'm just cool with it happening, I guess. Hey everybody. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt a ritual. I'll just help myself to all of your goods and be on my way. Uh, oh, lock pick. That's not a breakable box, you're kidding me. Capcom, what have you done? Retracing his backwards sunlight l math magic. That's a really good way to describe it. I like that. It's true. It's funny and true. <clears throat> Ham was fined in the demo? I don't remember. I don't recall it being all chomped. We are for these goats of warding to protect people, or protect the village and its people. Any break them shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. You don't say. Okay, so these are the breakable collect. I was wondering what the the smashables in this game would be. I guess they, they have that little like clickety sound too, so you can kind of hear when they're around. That's neat. That's fun. We have fun here. Yeah, the goat was doing a shit job. Well, it's not doing the job anymore. Cool. I'm gonna have to put some plates there. <laughs> no more emblem. Yeah. We're done with that. No bobbleheads. Goats. I can hear one. I heard one. Maybe it was just this. I think it was just that. On the way! Typewriter! Typewriter to Nemo! I love it, and I'll never say that I don't love it, because I do. Is it Van Helsing already? A nice photo of Van Helsing? I saw him, like, blink into existence. Oh god, PTSD, yeah. Well, let me tell you, I did not- I did not much like seeing that- that bookcase there next to the door. 
that was not a site that that I greeted warmly. I, that is interesting. They still they're still doing the map thing of like telling you if there's items you've missed. I don't know if do flower sacks count as missed items. Maybe it's upset that I left the drawer open. Weapon LTK. Oh, there we go. You'd like to you'd like to be told you're pretty. Well, allow me to do the honor of saying, Weapon LTK, you're very pretty. You might be the prettiest. I don't want to I don't want to jinx anything, but maybe. You know, you never know. I don't think anyone's come to conclusion on that. So, as long as the issue's open, it could be. This is kind of neat. We can go through tall grass with wolf men in it. Let me tell you, that's kind of spooky. Ow. I can't tell if this is just for effect or if there's actually a wolf man there. It really does seem like there's a wolf man. Yeah, there's a wolf man, all right. Okay. Just drastically inefficient. Want to see? Want to see if the ladder strat will work for the whole sequence? I I don't see why not. Um, it, it seems maybe if you're just on the top rung of that specific ladder, because yeah, it seems like it seems like the zombies. The zombie swipes don't get you, and the hammer swipes don't get you. It's possible that, like, certain zombies were clumped up in exactly the right spot to prevent the hammer guy from getting me. It seems like the hammer guy is supposed to be the sort of get you no matter where you are entity for that sequence. Maybe. Please. Diddler 9000. Thanks for gifting five subs. Stay back. Please. Don't hurt us. He's fine. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. Where's Booba? I I'm mean, just glad to see normal people at last. Have you seen any other survivors? No. They're all in Louise's house, and she's not answering. And the gate is locked. I've been trying my best, but he's an outsider. Man, this intro was this intro was pretty raunchy. Pretty, pretty, pretty touching. Oh. Shit, we're sitting ducks in here. Can your old man walk? No. One of the monsters cut him. He's lost a lot of blood. We have to get into Louise's Shh, house. Quiet. Must be a way inside. Stay here. Be quiet. Don't move until I get those gates open. <coughs> you guys got a crank or something? I'd settle for a rocket launcher if you guys have that. No, just, just injury and death. Okay. As usual, all Ethan's a, all Ethan's on his own, huh? Okay, I'll take to the skies, or or not. No, that's not what we're doing. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if Ethan's hand was normal during the demo. I feel like it was. I think I. I feel like I would have noticed it if his hand had a big old chomp taken out of it. Ethan just has bad, bad hand luck. For real, I love this stream. The sickest intermissions, and I'm never afraid to speak my mind. Some of the best shit on Twitch. Well, I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad it works for you. Of course, certainly good news for me if, if people enjoy it. It's all about the games, though. It's all about the games and various uninformed hot takes. There are so many! Oh, you can push? Wait, what? Push the enemy away. 
Oh! Oh, there is kind of a counter. That's neat. This ain't the right way. I don't... I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I figured there ha I probably wasn't just supposed to turn around, but... The backyard of that house didn't have anything going on, so... I don't know. What am I supposed to do? Is he playing in VR? Yeah, I am. <laughs> Let's wait here, get the grunts out. Mm. Ooh. Stare at, stare at Booba Lady a little more. She's here. Just have yet to find her. There we go. <laughs> the blood sucks back into my wounds. Yeah, they like disengage now. Oh yeah, I am supposed to go this way. Yeah, look at that. Look. Look at that big old exclamation point. Guess this leads to the castle. Oh, sick. Oh, shit. We got puzzles. <sighs> oh, wait a minute. Is this, uh, okay. That's interesting. Yeah. There was a paragraph. Glad the mod caught that. You're welcome. I'll cram my, uh... Cram my photo into the lock and then pick it. <laughs> Be gone, spoiler bot! Whatever. Joke's on him. The, uh, the plot to Resident Evil is dumb as shit and it doesn't matter. Less paragraphs, more boobas. Couldn't agree more. Okay, well, I guess I'll run pa back past the grain fields. And go talk to the people again. Will I do that? Where the hell am I going? Hold on. See, this implies that you should be able to just go through here, but... Ah, eh, there's a tractor there. I'm sure it's this place. Nope. Torn's gonna ask for his left hand in order to get in. <laughs> ah, Jesus Christ. Wait, okay, hold on. Where the fuck am I going? And where have I come from? How did I even get up there? Do you have to go... Oh, you have to go through the... Okay, I see, I see. Wait, what? God, god damn it. They're doing me a favor. Moving me to the checkpoint. Alright. Okay. Where am I? Oh. Aw, oh, man. I've got to, like... Ah. Alright. Wait, where? Yes. Okay. Is blocking not directional? I... Uh... I don't... I don't know. I, I didn't think so, but maybe it is. Oh, yeah, I forgot I had a mine. That's, that'll be fun, I guess. What kind of keyboard do you use? Uh, it is a GMMK from uh, Glorious PC Gaming hey, what you Company, doing? I guess. Stay back. Save the mine, homie. Trust me. Yeah, Whoa. That's, that's probably a good call. It's okay. 
I'm not gonna hurt you. I do trust you. I'm just glad to see normal people. You know about the village of shadows difficulty? That's even harder. Survivors? No, I don't. No. I mean, there's only one way the game can be harder, and it's that's if the zombies kill you in one hit instead of two. Um, or I guess they could just have even more zombies. That they could do that. I didn't get the pro, no, because the pro's shorter, smaller, right? I actually like the numpad cluster. Shoot, we're sitting down I don't think the pro has the, the cluster on it, I don't think. No. But I could be wrong. One of the monsters cut him. He's lost a lot of blood. We have... Uh -huh. Okay. So, the objective is to find shelter in Louise's house. That's the thing I'm supposed to be doing right now. Uh, I'm supposed to go over this thing? Ah! I was supposed to go over that thing. Yes, of course. Oh, people who have- who get 10 keyless keyboards or numpadless keyboards? I don't know. I think it might actually be more more lead hacker to not have that. So then you can just like you can just shove your keyboard in your back pocket, strap on your inline skates to go hacking. Where did the prompt go? Gosh. It's the wildest thing. Come on, it's clear. Hurry. Hurry. How linear is this game? I mean, it's, it's a Resident Evil game. It's, it's pretty linear. Took your damn time. At least so far it is. I mean, I don't, I don't know what, what it turns into later. But we seen the merchant yet? No. He's not used to relying on other people. I'm sorry. We'll be safe in here, won't we? Safer here than out there. That's for sure. Hey, do you know anything about what's going on around here? It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected- Tried that ambush sequence in Village of Shadow difficulty just now. I had full health, sneezed in real life, looked back and the screen was dead. Father? Game uninstalled. PlayStation- We have to get inside! Melting down into slag. Man, they didn't even, like, make the eyes track to where your character model was. Just hold on a bit longer, Papa. Or Papa? Oh no, Papa. Mine, sweet papa. There's so much blood. So I gotta figure out how to break into this house. Hello? Anybody home? Maybe a familiar voice. Louisa! Open up! It's me, Elena! Stop shouting. You'll draw the monsters. Julian, calm down. Who's this? A friend. Stay back. <laughs> Father, for God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, no, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. But that's not my problem. What's going on? These people want to let a dying man into our home. Come now. These people are our friends. Go on. Go inside. Come now. This way. I don't like this guy. You're not from this village. Ah, uh, no. I'm Ethan. Yulian, go make yourself. Could really use a hand. I said go. Well, if Elena trusts you, then so do I. Come inside, Ethan. So far, th this really kind of feels more like we'll the intro to a Far I'll Cry game, others. like a spooky Far Cry game. I guess it's just a lot of, like, getting a lot of face of certain characters feels like that. Yeah, her facial animation was really good. It's really, really good. They seem to know that it's good, because there's a lot of, like... There's, there's a lot of shoving face into camera, for sure. Save. I should save. I'm looking at photos. Oh, yeah. Wonder if her papa is going to turn into a wolf man. Come inside, the others are waiting. What the 
fuck is this? Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed. Right, Anton. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing should, it, fine. should I care that they have like Please, Ethan. American Thanks. accents? Are we in? We're not in America. Is this all that's left from your Run. entire village? Come blue, come blue, Blithia. All that's left? There is no one left. A worthless uh, Europe invalid, a stupid, wailing bitch, and you. You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing and expect to be all safe? There is no safe! Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half. But tomorrow? Tomorrow we'll all be dead. Just like her damn husband. You know, I, I gotta admit I don't mind it. That's enough! I guess it's this better than just some generic my family for generations. Eastern European Anton, accent, you know. Or not, you are all welcome and safe in here. Whatever. Can someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? We don't know. One day we were a quiet, devout village, and the next, the monsters came so and the, attacked us. Resident Evil Village. And they, they kept coming. Wait, Louisa. And, where is your husband? Did they? No. N no, he he is out there. Somewhere. He, he he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's that's it. He, he went to fetch help. <laughs> Raffle Conti. The pray. evil was resident all along. For him. For Indeed, it was. Him. Good idea. Come. Gather. We truly were the most resident of evils. Is she not she hasn't reacted to my hand being half chewed Great off. Ones, hear our voice together as one in reverence. I guess that's pretty normal we here. Call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and, and in, in death, death, we give, give you glory, glory Mother, Mother Miranda. Miranda. Now, the tea should be ready. Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer, I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. <laughs> um, bitch is crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her, as it shall protect us. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Leonardo, what's wrong? Are you okay? Is he gonna wolf? Nice. Less nice. I didn't expect that entire, entire room to go down in the span of that single scene, but it sh they sure did. All right, I think I, I think I know what time it is. Mine time! I, it won't let me switch. All right. Never mind. It's cutscene time. Let him go! Lena. <laughs> I said no! Oh my god. I'm so Could have saved them bullets? How was I supposed to know? Hey, that wasn't your father anymore. Now I do. You did the right thing. Elena, Elena, no! There's nothing you can do! Papa! This entire place is collapsing! She just shot him twice. <laughs> I think she. I thought she was okay with it as soon as she did that. Save him. Eh. He was already gone. Who am I to judge somebody else's trauma? Leave me alone. Watching their no. father turn into a wolf we'll man. Together. <laughs> Everyone reacts to it differently. I gotta get out of here.
Last of Us, eat my ass. This is real drama. This is what people came to see. Oh, you want to see people get sad? Fine, whatever. Whatever a girl has watched Father Turn a Wolf Man get crushed by a flaming house. Okay? <laughs> Fine, we need Jeff Keighley give me an award. It's not that hard. You just make some <laughs> make somebody cry. Ooh, it's so sad. I made art. I can't wait. <laughs> this, I can't wait for the rest of the story, man. Oh, I love Resident Evil narratives. I left the shotgun behind. Man, I could use a shotgun right now. The key ring if you need it. Okay. Yep. What if I did this? <gasps> okay. So, like, it's, you know, it's a little weird that a Resident Evil game would give you, like, a whole... Run away from things, intense chasing cat and mouse sequence. Before they'd even have you like rotate an item. That's pretty crazy, right? They seem to want to just hit you with the wackiness right the off the top. Fast. <coughs> but what if I had a screwdriver? Uh. <laughs> oh shit! I just realized screwdrivers don't put out fires. Fuck! Fuck! Oh wait. I can open this now. Yeah, new Mia. How do you feel about verbally abusing me nonstop? Do you think you could do that? Oh, I think we have a bright future together then. Um. Hey, Mia too. Do you have any bright ideas for how to use a screwdriver to escape a burning house? This isn't a joke. I'm actually just asking. Oh, okay. Boarded window? Yep. Actually, I wonder. I'm not gonna. I'm not even gonna try. Step back. Not even explore. Start with this. But I wonder if full screen RTX would function a little bit better. If you need help, just holler. Okay. I have done pretty well not accepting any tips so far. I think I'll be just fine. <laughs> Let me back up again. The fire. There isn't any time. <coughs> oh, full, full screen doesn't help with the ray tracing. Okay. What? Ethan, you are really just stumbling through this game so far, aren't you? Let's move. All right. Don't okay. worry. And try not to breathe in the smoke. We, we turned a truck into I stairs. Know. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> try not to breathe kind. in the smoke. Okay, I'll choose not I to. Hope your family is safe. Thank you for I the help, too. Ethan. Thank you very much. Come on. Ethan's It'll just hold. a normal guy. I guess it is rare in Resident Evil to play a normal guy as opposed to an elite tactical there. zombie killing That's operative. Thank God. But what then? The village is still full of monsters. We can't fight them. There's too many. Hey, hey, don't talk. Yeah, that's true. I guess Ethan does have military training so now. I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. No, that place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? Elena, no. That's not him. Not anymore. <laughs> he said my name. She's already plugged in with two shotgun shells. I guess she's got to remove herself from the game somehow. Stay there. Come on, give me your hand. Yeah. Papa's alive. I can't believe it. Mine, Papa, I love you. Oh. Save your daughter. You can't do this. This is too much drama. No, it's too dramatic. This is 
this is too much. Buy your G fuel, 30% off. Oh man, Resident Evil is so cool. <laughs> oh, that was sad. That was sad. She was a, a pure European girl. Her whole life in front of her. And now all that's in front of her is a lot of burning wood and her own internal organs. So sad. This place is going mad. Why the fuck is this happening again? Son of a bitch! Oh, shit! Don't you die on me! I hope before I die, I get to play a doctor screaming at their patient to live. Like five minutes of nothing, just screaming, Live, damn you! Think of your daughter, you son of a bitch! Yeah, don't you die on me! Free gun! Oh, who's there? Oh, stop! Mother Miranda! Hey! <laughs> Ooh. Who, who was... What was that? <laughs> yeah, I guess... We already... We've already burned through Mia too. I wonder if that dude dropped an item. Is his body out here still? No, oh, I guess he going away already. I gotta admit too, is there like... Is there much of a reason to the crafting system? I guess once you get different kinds of ammo. But why can't they just give you bullets? Why do they have to give you the pieces that make bullets? Oh. Hello, nice lady. You probably won't Death. cast, like, bird magic on me. Yes. Death has visited them all. Oh, you buy recipes? Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's something. <laughs> they do just give you bullets sometimes. That's true. That's a good point. Ooh. 666 viewers for hardcore difficulty. Nice. Sometimes Twitch is all right. Hey. Hey, all of you out there on Twitch. You guys are all right. Just want you to know that. Guess this leads to the castle. That's weird. I guess I didn't pick that one. Oh yeah, it's in here. I guess I didn't do that on this save. Need someone to take my final exam? Well, you know what, Ben McSausages? Just because you're on Twitch and you're rad, I'll do it for you. Just mail it, fax it on over. Fax it on over to the HQ and I'll I'll take care of it first thing in the morning. You could save. That's true. Actually, I will. Here we go. All right. Now Resident Evil's going to start. Oh, baby. Ooh, it's Spooky Castle. Huh? It's a suspicious rope. Why are they drawing my attention to the water? Why would you do that? Yeah, no death run starts now. Now. Okay. Now it's Resident Evil Castle. Yeah, I'm curious. I'm curious how many scenarios, or how many, like, areas, different environments there are going to be in this game. Because if, if that was the village, the village is pretty small. Biomes, yeah. Everything is in returnal technology, or in returnal terms now. Man, the interiors do look so cool, though. Ugh. Reminds me of just full 3D versions of really, really crispy pre-renders from back in the day. Alright. 
Well, I guess I need this item to progress, and I don't have it. Oh, it's well, a switch. Well. Didn't think anyone was left. You must be pretty tough. Huh. Who the fuck are you? Oh, you're not local. Even better. Mother Miranda's gonna love you. <laughs> Dude has magnet power? What the? This guy's some anime shit. Is he ever? He's steampunk! Wait, you're whining. We're almost there. He is a very uh, bloodborne looking character. He does remind me of Nick Cage. Yeah, there's. The man is of no real use to anyone else, and my daughters do so love entertaining foreigners. Uh, I think I know that voice. Whoa, cool! My daughters and I will deliver the Play ugly if I want to see. He's away. I like the little doll. What? She even moves kind of like she's stop stop motion. Around with him in private. Where's the fun in that? Give them to me. And I'll That's awesome! Oh my gosh! So gauche. That character design is Red fantastic. The man thing's suffering is assured. Yeah, yeah, because a man's dick is cut off in the castle. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg, the man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn hole! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was welded oh, to Oh, keep growing. One day your head might actually fit your ego. Fight, 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 hey, fight, don't fight, I get a fight, say in this? <laughs> Silence! My decision is final. There will be no argument. Sorry if that was Remember crackly. From whence you came. Thank you. Huh. Lycans and gentlemen. We thank you for waiting. And now let the games begin! Let's see what you have here. Ethan Hunters. Da-na-na. Da-na-na. Get ready. Da-na-na. No! Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Yeah, there's 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 a lot of Nick Cage energy in that dude's performance. I like it though. Ah, Jesus Christ! Scary hallway, no! Run for your life! They actually set up a spooky hallway for you to run through. That must be nice. It's nice to have hobbies. Very nice, Ethan. <laughs> A quarantine hobby? Let's set up a spooky hallway. Oh, he's gonna, you shall not pass me. He's even got the beard, man. There's... How did that even happen? He just like nudged his way into a giant slide. You're still alive? Impressive. Oh, never mind. That's a spike room. Yeah, the force, the, the hammer smashing into the ground propelled him down the slide, I guess. Whatever, works for me. Shit! I like how they, they have little escapes all over the place just so they can... My word. They just have a series of spooky hallways for you to run down. Oh, it's so great. Oh, you didn't think I'm- No! Gotta keep 
Donna and Moreau entertain. So now it's time for the beautiful. There's a little hole here, right? Grand finale. It's probably fine. <laughs> Nothing like fresh American ground beef! <laughs> Dopiest shark. Yeah, these these guys have a fun sensibility about them. They're just having a good time. Too close. Wait, do those freaks have rows? Well, they have 300 less lay at, at this point, so... <laughs> How do I still have all my guns? That seems a little weird. I guess he didn't ever disarm me, he just cocooned me in random steampunk bits. <laughs> Gears and widgets and brass things. Alright, he's not Van Helsing though. Are you four vibes? You think? I guess, yeah, big clankety clankety castle traps were a Resident Evil 4 thing at some point. Yeah, there was, a, there was a whole weird castle sequence to 4, and it got pretty goofy, too. Can I pull the switch in peace now? Thank you. I'm not gonna lie. I think I probably would have preferred some quiet walking around castle segments. I didn't... You know, I guess they needed to introduce their rogues gallery. They haven't really done that yet, so... It's just weird that, like, ugh, there's, like, I mean, this, I remember the, like, wasn't there, like, a Resident Evil 4 map that was nearly identical to this? Like, a, a circular road leading up to the castle? And then there was, like, an ex a truck with, like, exploding barrels that comes down the road? Oh, you're gonna get the quiet walk around stuff soon? Okay, okay. Snow looks very good. I mean, the game looks really good. Can't deny that. Nope, nope. Merchant time? Okay. Uh, I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winters. How do you know my name? Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. A hero searching for his daughter. Though I must say that castle arouses suspicion. Yeah, and so do you. <laughs> I am but a humble merchant. Here? Oh, forgive my manners. Call me the Duke. Now to business. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, anything you desire, I can provide. He did pronounce the L in salve. I don't know. I always like saying salve. It makes me feel cool. Any word where you can just ignore some can of the letters makes you something. feel like a I goddamn boss. A special present for you. Like, like your, your, your lord class. Mmm, a salve for the morning. Well, you see, I'm intelligent enough to know that it you don't say salve. I know that. Uh, of course I can't. Of course I can't. Buy upgrades. I can't buy anything. Oh, I get wait, do you get this for free? Oh. Okay, that's right. There was like a pre order thing that was like a survival pack. So I guess I get free bullets. Uh -huh. Yay! I hope that's like a free physics object so I can see it dangling around. Yes, I can see why you'd be interested in that. Ah... Uh. Pay to win. Feels good. This is all an investment, even. I want to see Thank this. Thank you for your patronage. This is what video games are all about, right here. Little danglies on the end of your gun. Is this also a speedrun strat? Yes. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta, um, dangle the thing around to manipulate well, RNG. Ethan. That's what it's for. I always, it's always interesting to me how, like, since the merchants are the more video gamey part of the game, they also sort of acknowledge the video game parts of it. Like, how does he already know who Ethan is and what he's doing? It's because he's aware that, he's aware of the video game part of it. 
none of the other NPCs know, right? Or maybe they don't care. No, they know. They abducted his daughter. Never mind. I guess I guess it does actually make sense in context of what's going on. Because I guess Ethan's daughter is super important. Because could Rose be here? Mia gave her super genes. Bella Cassandra Daniela. Inky, Blinky, and Clyde. Uh-oh. Get ready. Get ready for uh, free items. Sign the guest book. You're right. It's only... Uh, it's only a uh, polite E than Wintars. There we go. A man who definitely knows how to spell his own name. Ah, uh, had to try it. No wonder she hates you. Go to her house and bust up her shit. To be fair, they've done far worse things to me already. I feel like, in exchange for a chunk of my hand, I should be allowed. I should be allowed to to break a couple of things. I'm tired of being on the ground. Man blood. <laughs> yeah, this is the front room from the demo, yeah. <laughs> what are we laughing about? Mother, bring me fresh prey. You are so <laughs> kind to me, daughters. <laughs> the poor bit rate. Yeah, I now, guess all the bees. Let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. I don't have the sickles on my feet anymore. <laughs> Starting to go a little stale. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, Mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, daughters. First, I must inform Mother Miranda. But later, well, there will be enough for everyone. <laughs> Udama! Hey, hey, wait. <laughs> oh, be careful what you wish for, Ethan Winters. <laughs> Wait, what, 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 what are you doing? It looks so good. <laughs> But also, I feel like I feel like the body terror of bad things happening to Ethan just doesn't work anymore. It's been over overused. All right. So I'm. Am I just gonna yank my hands out of it? That feels like something I would do. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Why not? I mean, does he does he have like Also, that doesn't make any sense. You can't like you can't pull and then be heavier than you are anyway. Um crazy butchers. Does he still have like crazy mold healing power? Is that a deal? All right. Got to pour got to pour a little Mountain Dew all over those wounds. I did forget about the crazy <laughs> the the crazy uh, antibiotics of Resident Evil series. 
Oh, it's okay. This is the beginning of the demo. Yeah. All right. Oop. Oh, wait. That's right. There's actually nothing in it. Oh, God. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh. We have arrived. We have. 15 minutes. Or, sorry, 30 minutes. Gotta play the game as fast as possible. I mean, I got I got pretty fairly murdered here in the demo on hardcore. So, but then again, even this sequence in the demo was a little was a little a little aggravatingly mechanics based because you just had to sort of sidestep all the all the B ladies until you got to the like the specific place you needed to go to to kind of trigger the next thing. Yeah, is that is that going to be most of this game? Just like. Maybe maybe it's more like a Resident Evil 3 type Resident Evil where there's just like more cinematic and planned sequences connected by a way too short walk like quiet walking sequences. I don't know. It'll be interesting to see. What is a different makeup? <laughs> rat mocap. We have <laughs> Imagine a little rat wearing like Wearing a little suit with balls on it? Or like one ball? <laughs> what about rat AI? Reactive at rat AI? Yeah, You're still in the exposition part of the game? Okay. I'll trust that it'll... And I, I guess I need to... I do need to cut the game's pacing some slack. I did spend an awful lot of time in what is probably meant to be uh, a... A, a probably like an easy breezy intense cinematic intro. Where have they taken Rose? Oh, we meet again, Duke. Why are you here? Where there's coin to be made. <clears throat> and have you found your daughter? No. If she is truly I've here, been stabbed through of both of my legs and my hands. Rose in her private chamber. That's all I've done she so not. far. Domitresk? The very same. Oh, Troganator. Thank you, you for tipping the uh, $4.20. Lucky. Appreciate that. And speaking of looking, care to make a purchase? As you wish. I, uh, I guess I do have more currency than I did last time. Pay me no mind. Thank you for your patronage. All right, game started. I did it. I did it. Okay, that was neat. It's just a teensy bit of that like typewriter theme in the background there. I like that. Ah, uh, that's fun. Also, oh, I guess because it, it was all the reloading. So, yeah, my playtime's only an hour twenty-one, but I've been I've been playing for three hours. So, half of all the time in the game now has been spent running around in loops and getting chumped by wolfmen. So, I gotta cut the game some slack when it comes to how I'm perceiving its pacing. That was entirely my decision. So, as I recall, you run upstairs to trigger the bee lady. I guess I might as well. It's probably better to go around and swoop up some items before that happens. A few items? No. Oh, it's already been here. Okay. All right. Weird that it only counts that, not the actual playtime. Yeah, it is kind of. I guess, I, well, yeah, you would think it'd be total playtime for, for, like, ranking and stuff like that. But I guess they also... <gasps> I guess they also uh, punish you for saving a lot, too, so... Oh, one of the daughters is voiced by Jill from RE3. Makes sense. Capcom probably worked with the same casting and performance agency, and... They probably worked with the same talent they like working with, so it makes total sense. I mean, she did a great job in 3, so why not? Why not cast her again? 
It, it seems to be doing a pretty or doing pretty well at mixing the silliness from six and the sort of realism from seven. It's not quite as silly as six. Um, gosh, tonally, it's in a weird spot tonally right now. Actually, kind of, I kind of can't place it at the moment. This is when you get bees. And then... I can't... I actually can't remember where they wanted me to go after the bees. After the clarion call of bee. Yeah, six is just totally absurd. I haven't cut open a man in a while. Let what? me string... You are taking a lie, dead, which would you prefer? That's what's crazy is like... You... I, I feel like I just did a sequence where I was running from stuff. But whatever. That's right. That was the thing. I never found that corner in the demo. It, like, took way too long to do it. I read that in the, in the demo. I don't have to read it again. Your hand's healed? It's those antibiotics, man. Resident Evil Heal Juice is something else. I like to think that her dump truck ass, like, shoved the needle off the record as she was walking out. That's kind of what it looked like. She didn't, she didn't, she didn't reach over and do it with her hands. So something did it. Oh, yeah. Huh. I gotta admit, this is, this is a pretty neat puzzle. Uh... Kind of a kind of a lateral think sort of thing. Oh, Chuppy Vision! Thanks for gifting five subs. I haven't died in a while, so I can see that I see that uh, it's clearly paying off. This is the ray tracing room. Yeah, it would be. There, there is definitely like a certain warmth that is lacking because playing the demo on um, on PS5, I'm pretty sure ray tracing was enabled, and you know, frame rate wasn't as high. But man, man, do these interiors have a certain just. Wonderful coziness about them. That hit, I gotta admit, it's not quite there when it, uh... When it's just, you know, quote-unquote normal computer graphics. Ray tracing, I think, does kind of elevate it to that pre-rendered background sort of look. I feel like it's because pre-rendered backgrounds always did a lot to play around with lighting because that's the thing that they couldn't do in real time like shadow like long shadows and really harsh lighting and stuff like that uh it's just kind of the look of early 3d renders and stuff hmm. oh chuppy vision thank you i think ethan could use some g fuel well, that's the thing. We could all use some G Fuel at 30% off this weekend using code SIRLAR at gfuel.com. Oh, is this when they start hitting you with some actual zombies? Or are there just more wolfmen down here? Jabba Wobs, thanks for the sub. You've been stepped on yet. Actually, yes. Wait, physically stepped on? Yeah, I've been dragged. There was another one. There's always another one.
Have I killed any of these yet? I think that was that one, yeah. Jeez. Without all this uh, pre-ordered free ammo, I would be in serious trouble. Oh, no, wait, I did get this one. Okay. They seem to be quite difficult. They are quite difficult. They just take take a lot of ammo. Luckily, it, it seems like it is pretty... You can, you can do a fair amount of just tussling with them by doing the block and pushback. That gives you... A fair amount of time to line up another shot. Or a couple of shots. Ooh. Where the hell did you come from? Oh, they're getting up. Sack of coins. Love it. Oh boy, that's a lot. I probably was supposed to sell all the skulls and stuff and picking up, huh? Probably. Here's your Spectro Patronum charm. The one on the end of my shotgun. guys stagger if you shoot their legs I mean they they don't stagger when you shoot their head so uh, I don't know odds seem low but I can try it Again, I just wish I could cram my photo in that lock I can't believe Cassandra <laughs> caused all this mess Boy, I'm getting bead. Bees. Bees. I can't believe Cassandra. Bees! A healthy man's blood. Mm. Let's, well, let's not be too hasty about that healthy part. I have eaten a lot of Hot Pockets in my day. Where are you going, little one? I'm on the ground again. <laughs> Bullets cannot harm. <laughs> That's cool. Cold. All right. You stupid. That's cool man. indeed. I see an item next to you, and I want it though. So like, does cold make her corporeal? Ow. Ow. Okay. Move your hand. <laughs> Let me cut you in the face. This can't be! 
Seems weird that I've already. Hmm. Okay. Figured that would be more of a thing. It's one of three. Yeah. We're on our way. Maybe the others will decide that this life of violence uh, will only lead to more violence in the end. And perhaps they will uh, decide to let me go. They will say that... Oh, that label seems like it should be peelable. Oh, okay. They will realize that uh, it's just not worth it, you know? Another one was sent to the cellar. She only spilled some soup. Everyone knows what happens when you're sent to the cellar. You're never seen again. They drain your blood, your soul cursed to wander the halls. I went looking for her, and when I found her, she was just skin and bones and gnawing on a rat carcass. I suspect it'll be my turn next. <laughs> Don't spill soup! And that won't be a problem. This seem a little early to kill off a main villain like that. Eh. I mean, there are there are two more, not to mention a wolf man. Ooh, and a uh, and a vampire mom and a cult eater. Increased firepower. Praise God. Yeah, I was going to say, the absolute first thing I'm going to do is save up all of my Resident Evil coins to uh, upgrade the firepower of my handgun. How far in is this? Eh, about an hour and a half. This is this is basically just after the... just after the demo. Or the castle demo. Depending on how far you were able to get, I guess. The, the castle demo had a hard stop, too, right? Like, you could finish it. I could be wrong, though. She was more of a mini-boss, yeah. It seemed like she was just there to explain the mechanic uh, that you have to use cold to make them vulnerable for the time you actually fight one of them. Oh, yeah, the underground lab that's inevitably in this game at some point. Yeah, who knows? Who knows what the underground lab in 8 will look like. I can't wait. She was a tutorial. Yeah. That was a pretty good tutorial. I mean, I've been... I've been a little starved Welcome. for tutorials. Welcome. You're sure to find something new. You wish to make a purchase? Yeah, okay. Oh, no. Look at all these things I could have been selling. Your coin. That sounded like Hitman. Aha. Aha. Please do take a look at my good day then. Now I'm now I'm into it. Upgrade weapons to full so you can save ammo. Yeah. I mean damage damage increases the value of every bullet. Beyond that, it's just kind of yeah, DPS stuff. But it is very much in my interest to make sure that every single bullet I have is as damage dealing as possible. Ah. I can't get grabbed by Big Lady yet. Hello G or hello Sonic fan. Hey. You have half your bingo sheet done with this game? That's that's pretty fast. Uh, where am I headed? I guess, what did I pick up? I got the wine bottle. Uh... 
explore upstairs more? Yeah. I keep forgetting there's an upstairs. Perhaps the wine goes to wine room. Oh, yeah. Oop. Hold on a second. Aha! Seems pretty blunt. I mean, I guess in any Resident Evil game, you really only have like one or two places to explore. I'm gonna swing back through this other side of the upstairs. It doesn't seem like this game has the gory damage models on enemies when you shoot them like RE2 Remake. Uh, did I wish it did? Yeah, that that was a neat, that was a neat little piece of tech. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I mean, this game just has like crazy crazy visual quality. You go back through there. I guess you could. I guess there's an item in there I missed. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, you can you can shoot heads. That's true. I popped a few heads with a shotgun. That's a nice feeling. Too many enemies for them to all have that stuff on them. That's that's a good point. I feel like there have been more wolf men on screen than there have been there were ever zombies on screen in Resident Evil Remake. Love enemy enemy models that can get disfigured. Yeah, Doom Eternal is really good for that. This is what does the FOV gets? Yeah, unfortunately, I think I I haven't found an option to to widen it out because yeah, it is pretty it is pretty run up on the uh, the camera. Ah. Shall I give you the tour? Calf, I think you're looking for the uh looking for the uptime command. There it is. Bees. No, oh, she's attacking my frame rate directly. That's okay, she can't get me out here. It's cold. These are supposed to be cute? I mean... Well, I... I have to admit, I think they're more wasps than bees. I still think they're somewhat cute. She got that, like, mom's angry stomp. <laughs> what have you done to my daughter? Hell yeah. Now we're doing it. Yes. Got a map. Oh, Neato Cheeto. Thank you for the raid. Ooh. A spooky blood room. Don't mind if I do. Women are blind to male advances, but the poor shall take their chances to give their lord their bounty sown so that soon the wine may flow. Oh man, there's gonna be a sick, a sick riddle about where these people should be looking. Oh wait, they they already gave it to me, I think. When I'm blind to male advances, Porsche should take the chances. Uh to give the Lord their bounty sown. So okay. So women ignore dudes. Are you women? You seem to be women's. Oh. 
Men advance towards women's. Women's ignore man's. And poor people give uh, wine to the... Wait, hold on. It's going to wind my flow. I don't know. I always feel like in puzzles like this, there's, I don't know, there's like weird things that you're either meant to assume or that I'm supposed to be assuming that, hmm, poor giving the bounty to the Lord. Is the Lord not the rich person with the wine? Woman blind, face her away from men. Yeah, maybe it's like that. Oh, there we go. Wait, what? That was all kinds of backwards. <laughs> Whatever. I'd be a lady, not a lord. I guess that's true. Only lords own horses. Women don't look at men. Yeah, you're right. I should have known better. Ooh. Come on, Ethan. We can do this, buddy. Oh, come on, buddy. Ooh, it's tough. Oh, wait. Oh, there's a crouch in this game. Yeah. I was like, are these fools the really, go really going to make me spend a bullet on this? This is pretty scary. That is a l maybe not so scary. Angry man flopping into some blood. Wine blood. Or does are they trying to tell me that there's sickle men's hiding in the hiding in the wine? Ah! That's kind of neat. They show you the ripples. I like that. Pretty classic RE thing of like shh. Having like enemies in water or something like that. Is that blood or wine? Exactly. <laughs> Jokes on you, it's AIDS blood? That doesn't matter anymore, man. It's 2021. AIDS is like. AIDS is like coronavirus. We fixed it. You know, provided you're rich. Still gotta be rich enough to afford health care. No, Joe! In the first place. That's the real that's the real trick. Oh, there's another one. Ow! Okay. You gotta like. There's definitely a startup to bringing a block. Move, dude. There, Jesus. While you guys were stumbling around in wine, I studied the blade. Oh, I'm forgetting that's not. It's not block. Even though it, like, he kind of, like, pulls his hands up and gets ready for action. Ooh. Sure is some kind of village out here. Man. 
This is this has been super linear so far. Doesn't really feel like there's ever been a moment where they kind of un unleash me on an, on a an area that I'm free to explore. Does that really mean I can't? Oh, and then there's this. Is she gonna throw the thing? Is she gonna be mad? Is she gonna be big lady? See you, Zaviax. Have a good night. She... Mother Miranda, I I'm probably gonna hang up the stream pretty quickly here. Ethan it's getting late. Has escaped. I got plans tomorrow. I got a bathroom to clean tomorrow. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. Yeah, it did look like she was looking right at me through the mirror. Yeah, but maybe no. not. Mother Miranda. So. Yes, of course. I understand the importance of the ceremony. Vegan. I won't let you. Boomer bedtime. A little bit. A little bit. Oh! Ooh, she mad. To hell with the ceremony. That man will pay for what he's done. Oh, you were commenting on zooming out of the basements. All right, yeah, yeah, you're right. That is definitely a toss a rose over the shoulder sequence. Be like, peace. <sighs> Uh, Rose, where are you? We were called by Mother Miranda to decide the fate of the child's father. Just thinking of that family meeting makes me shudder. To think I am treated like a sister to those miscreants. Especially Heisenberg. That riffraff wouldn't know proper manners if they slapped him in the face. I would have sliced him to ribbons if Mother had stopped me. Why? Why does she treat me the same as them? She gave me this castle, obedient daughter's everlasting, everlasting life. Did she not? Am I not her favorite? Am I not special? I need a drink. Yeah, that sounds like it's gonna be the story of Resident Evil 8. Uh, I need a drink. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well. Guess I'll go out the way I came in. No? Okay. <laughs> yeah, you can stand there, but you can <laughs> Uh Uh Is there like a ladder out here or something? <gasps> You're not a ladder. This big lady crushed you yet? No. I've been I've been abused and maimed in many other different ways, but have yet to get crushed by big lady. I'm sure it'll happen before long. What is going on here? Am I missing an item in this room? Wear her dress? That must be it. Is that a door by the window? Break window. Which, what? Break window. Oh, there we go. All right. She big? All this for a child who isn't even here. Don't be big, do me. You ungrateful, selfish wretch. You come into my house. You lay your filthy man hands on my daughters. And now you even try to steal my property. How dare you. Back on the floor again. Go ahead, do your worst. I don't like it when Ethan tries to sound tough. Also, am I might just okay? It's a different. It's a different basement. It's like, gosh, did they really just toss me right back? <sighs> Let's 
This music is alright. This feels like an arena where I'm meant to kite an enemy a lot. <sighs> Well, there goes the other one. Blackheart let you get away. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Before you ever see the child. So, I... Okay, well, here comes the kiting. Like House Mommy Tresk. <laughs> you don't say, Resident Evil. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my God. Oh. Okay, fine. That's fine. You know what? You can you can claw the back of my head off with that one. That's that's okay. Uh, Ethan Skay, thank you very much for the sub. Uh, if she pushes you through the floor because of your man hands, imagine what she'll do if she discovers your silent flute. Oh, it's not silent. Old Winter's family secret. Let me just grip this firmly with my right usable hand. I do like how she like anime slashes your hand off. That's awesome. Blackheart let you get away. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Before you ever see the child. You will learn what it means to insult House Dummy Tresk. promise I wasn't. Apologize with your life. But then the engine got weird. It's too late to turn back. Okay. You died of lag? Yeah, right? Man, I feel like it's been a long time since lag got me. Hacking, yeah, she's probably using a router exploit or something. You will learn what it means to insult how God, what the fuck? She can do that during this animation? Really? Oh, I'm I'm fucked. Well, oh, maybe I got away. Yeah, now to open this door with my favorite connected hand. Wait, how can I do that without a right hand? Just <laughs> running will get you nowhere. I entered this game with ten fingers and I'm down to like three. He just flex taped his own hand. <laughs> okay. Okay, this game is tiptoeing towards Resident Evil 6 status. Do not flex your fingers, Ethan. Did it heal the jacket too? Are you fucking kidding me? This castle. He's he's got mold power, right? That's like that's his thing. That happened in 7. He like molded 
They stapled his hand back on. Oh, fuck. I thought it connected over. Oh yeah, I got an upgraded gun. This is gonna be easy. Love hard, yeah. I mean, it's I've been okay with the challenge so far. Maybe, maybe accepting that that initial sequence that is just a real rough thing to slap somebody with out the gate. Also, I I also feel like it's just a rough sequence to drop on a, a beginning player in general. An opera hall? That sounds dramatic. Okay, okay. This is feeling a bit more like Resident Evil now. When they since treatment, the three girls have stopped moving. They almost seem dead. An insect flew out of the eldest's mouth. It appears to be a common fly. Two days since treatment, all three bodies are covered in flies. It appears the flies are consuming their flesh. When I opened a window, some of the flies dropped dead to the floor. It would seem cold petrifies them. I quickly closed the window to avoid weakening the insects further. Four days since treatment, all three bodies have almost been completely consumed by the insects. All that's left is dark, writhing, human-shaped mass of creatures. It is just afternoon, and the insects have started to change color. Those around the face turned, and turned pale, and those around the lips turned into a deep crimson. Six days since treatment, the mass of insects have transformed into human bodies again. All three girls awoke, looking at me like newborns. I sense a bond between us, like mothers and daughters. I've already decided their names, but like Daniela and Cassandra. Cool. So they're just bugs. They are straight up bugs. Just a big pile of bugs. No stealth kills? I don't know. Do you think? Do you think that's something this game would do? Hey, sure you king. Welcome. You just got here, what'd you miss? Whole lot of dying. Wow, just tons of dying. Alright, I'll try and... Oh, he's looking this way, so... Cool. Definitely stealth kill this guy. Nope. Never mind. He turned around. Do not have the bullets to do that to too many more zombies. I mean, whatever they are. <laughs> Castle servants? <laughs> so hold on. So that's... Oh, okay, they actually tell you? There we go.
I believe the technical term is gimp. What a devious puzzle. Yeah, this, some, this almost feels like it's, I don't know, it feels like it's weirdly going through the motions. It's like, there's gotta be keys, there's gotta be puzzles, but... Uh, scientific name, none. A similar body structure to blowflies, although there are differences in the head. They are carnivorous and vigorously consume meat. In order to catch unsuspecting prey, they'll gather using pheromones to mimic a human. <gasps> so they're sexy bugs. They are produced when a cadeau lays eggs in its host, but the flies themselves are unable to reproduce. They are weak to sudden drops in temperature, especially if the temperature drops below 10 degrees Celsius or 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Their metabolism lowers. They go into a dormant cryptobiotic state, similar to the cryptobiosis of the tardigrade or polypedalum vanderplanki. Vanderplanki. Interesting. Bug lore. Big bug facts. You're going to want those bug facts. It says there's still an item here, but I did get a new a new key. Okay, yeah, I know those doors. There were some of those back in the uh, back in the village too. Basement two, I think so. Don't recall that one off off the top, but but this is cool though. I mean, this is what it's all about, right? Picking up keys and going and figuring out where they what they unlock, finding new places, picking up items and solving puzzles, figuring out how to make your way around an interior. A space that you gradually learn to, it's a to see you learn the ins and outs of. Things. No sign of Rose. I'm so sorry it turned out that way. Well, you'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Yeah, the women are bugs in every yeah, Resident Evil. It's just a weird thing. Oh, Roy Boy, thanks for gifting us up. Thanks to your consistent patronage, I've expanded my services. You wish to make a purchase? No, I'm not selling that. Hard times, Ethan. Wait, what did you expand? Oh, that's mean. Ten grand, damn. Ah. Ah. Okay, okay. Well, neat. Okay, I'm, I I do like games that have internal currencies. Man, am I a sucker for that. A good deal. But it'll have to wait till tomorrow. Uh, I'll be back streaming tomorrow. I think uh, I'm I'm hungry, but I'm gonna be back with a chipper attitude and uh, more progress on hardcore Resident Evil 8. Um, I'm hoping the game is finally setting into this. Like I, I want to go around this castle and, and kind of explore where I want to go. Finding the right, finding the right, like, scripted hallway to run down, just so Ethan can get shoved to the floor and have something shoved through his body or a new thing pulled off of him. I'm just like, all right, I get it. <laughs> I get it. It's, it's happened enough at this point. So, yeah, hopefully it's just in, in smooth Resident Evil times from here. But, uh, man, that intro was something else. That was a, that was a hell of a thing. It's a good thing I found that ladder. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you were part of the raids, thank you for hanging around. Definitely appreciate that, too. And I'll be back with more video games tomorrow. Hopefully, hopefully you guys have a good time. Oh, it's Friday! It's gonna be Friday! We get a whole weekend. We get a new Resident Evil. It's the weekend. Mm mm mm. All right. See you guys. Have a great, have a great rest of your night, day, whatever it is. Catch you next time. Bye.